Nope, I'm not dead. I like how you just kind of accept it, though, and you just say, well, he was old. <laughs> One way to get over it. 47 is the new 97, am I right? Hello, everyone. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Well, welcome me, because you were already here. How are you doing? Barely knew him. <laughs> I apologize in advance if my brain's a bit fried. <laughs> I'm on heavy antibiotics, so <laughs> I'm going to try my best here. <laughs> You're 40 seconds late. God damn it. Sorry, my excuse of being on antibiotics does not hold up if I was 40 seconds late. I didn't realize I did something so horrible. It's okay, Gramps. Thank you so much. <laughs> you know just how to make me feel better. Lonely, thank you very much for the tip there. I like that. <laughs> Thanks for the gifted sub earlier as well. How are you all doing, everybody? Asmer where? Asmer there on the shelf. I moved the couch here yesterday, down down here, and uh, playing some video games because my foot hurts. <laughs> I'm nearly on the verge of going back to the walking stick again. So, it'll be back over there soon. I could do it now, but I don't want to hobble around on the stream, so... We'll see. Uh, uh, six to eight weeks. I'll say. <laughs> That's my uh, rush. That's on the fast track. Just like the guitar. Which, by the way, the cap was back on. I need to fix it. <laughs> How is the foot? It's sore. It's really sore. Welcome everyone joining. Why is it on the guitar again? Look. I forgot, okay? I was playing it and it's just out of habit now. I'll have to get into the habit of taking it off. So give me six to eight weeks and it'll be off again. <laughs> I don't really uh, stick with it, do I? <laughs> Welcome everyone just joining. Late? Are you saying yourself or me? Because I'm on time. Maybe you're talking about yourself. Why are you still saying that I've died when I'm here literally in front of you talking to you? You're like, ah... Holograms. Has technology gone too far? Foxy, thank you for the bits as well. Do you think wandering ever in slippers could be why you got a foot hurty? No, but I've accepted to, like, just doing that now because of my foot hurty. Like, I don't know what started it. I think it was the cold. But, um, yeah, I was saying yesterday, I do little streams sometimes. You should, you should definitely be on the Discord below me if you're a sub, because I do, like, private streams once, only once a month, because it's hard to fit them in, but, um, they're always super chilled out. I'm, I was telling people about it, and uh, I've just been, like, when I went on walks and stuff outside just to get some air, I've just been going in my slippers, because I've just accepted that it's too sore to wear shoes. <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm just walking around in slippers, but I probably just look like a lunatic. All right, well, who cares? Breaking points. Uh, Emia, Revenant, Christopher, Mandy, and Zay, thank you very much as well. Very kind. Can you greet Charlotte, who's celebrating the birthday? Well, happy birthday in advance, Charlotte. Sorry, I won't be here to wish you a happy birthday tomorrow. I'll be dead from foot d disease. <laughs> it, it, it doesn't have a name yet. I hope they're going to name it after me. Rez and Lonnie, thank you very much as well. Is the antibiotics frying your brain because you were a bacteria? <laughs> Maybe you're on to something. <laughs> Squirkilo, uh, Shambo, uh, Brotorus, thank you very much for the sub as well. Captain Skills, Sharp Perry, VHS Buffy, Ellis, Libby. Um, appreciate the support. Thank you. Kevin's foot dead. Kind of, yeah. Kind of, kind of. Um, you're not the real Kevin. Is there some, like, a conspiracy after starting up here or what? <laughs> Kevin, dating shows your new addiction. Maybe. This one, I think I may have seen clips of before. I'm not sure if it's the same one. Um, but sure, it should be good crack anyway. Uh, Max recommended me this one, so if it's really bad, we all blame him. Imposter Kevin? Uh -huh. <laughs> Look, we'll have, uh, we'll have Among Us soon. Then we can be the real imposter. It's gonna be so good. Um, <laughs> Max just like, no. <laughs> Don't put me on the spot like this. <laughs> Let me do a little tweet, and we'll catch up with some alerts, and we'll get started in, in about five minutes or so. Um, right, there we go. Tweet it out. Uh, Potter, thank you for the tip. Uh, Buratorus, uh, Abby, Hydro, Dr. A, Gravity Freaks, Jason, My Chemical Mermaid, and Radhaf, thank you very much for the subs as well. 
I need help with alcohol. What does that mean? You mean you have too much? Sorry, I can't help you. I'm on antibiotics. <laughs> Among Us. I am Among Us new map on Wednesday. I'm so excited. I don't know. Does anyone know what time it's coming out? Oh my god, Navi, thank you very much for the subs. Jesus Christ almighty. I, I, my brain isn't even functioning. I'm like looking at it and being like, is this real? <laughs> Navi, thanks so much for the 48 subs. Jesus Christ. I appreciate it. What, what is that rounding to a number or something? It's very specific. 48. How do we see the private streams? Um, I send an alert once a month on the Discord. They're pretty impromptu because I just have to fit them in when I can. You can also see them on Discord and the U YouTube community tab if you're a channel member. Um, Navi, thanks so much for that. Jesus Christ. I, I'm curious why 48. It's so specific. <laughs> Thank you so much, though. That's very, very kind of you. Um, oh, Jesus. Uh, Thunder, uh, Thundery, thank you for the spark. Thank you for the spark. Oh, no. <laughs> Thundery spark, thank you for the sub. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, the enemy, thank you for the sub. Uh, Merrick said, uh, thank you for the sub as well. Fots McGee, Evie, Charlotte, King Spade, El Elise, Kiltsva, uh, Scotty, thank you so much for the bits as well. Um... <laughs> Scott sad, Scott no more appendix, Kevin make happy. I, I, I don't know if I can, I don't know if that's you typing it like that or if my brain is just reading it wrong. <laughs> no, I hope you're feeling better though, Jesus. Hope you're alright. I imagine that must be quite the, the process to go through. Uh, are you going to do be making some more music covers? Yes, I want to. Hopefully I'll get one or two done in April. Brain hurt, foot pain. <laughs> Stop, you're confusing me. <laughs> my brain is just getting fried. Oh, my brain's not going to be able to, like, comprehend what's going on with this dating show, is it? Navi, thank you so much for that. Let me catch up here and we can, we can get started. Oh, no, time is standing still. <laughs> I feel like I'm high. <laughs> I just, like, my brain is just warped. I don't know how. I, it's my third week of antibiotics, but my first day of, like, the the strongest ones. I'm on seven pills a day. So I'm just like, <laughs> I'm just so out of it. Uh, Butts McGee, Evie, Charlotte, King Spade, Elise, uh, Kelsfa, Scotty, thank you again. Uh, Wet Ass Office, thank you so much for the 10 subs. That's super kind. Yeah, I appreciate it. Not a chance. Thank you for the 50 as well. I'm I'm legit looking at it just like, what? <laughs> I just feel so dazed. <laughs> I felt kind of okay, just a bit like tired before I started, but now I'm just like, whoa. <laughs> Not a chance. Thank you so much for the 50 subs. That is so kind of you. Thank you very much. And again, Navi, thank you so much for that as well. Um, Navi, thank you for the bits too. Rounding up to 2,600 gifted subs. Good lord. Thank you so much. That is very kind of you. hell. I still remember the first time you, you jumped in chat and started gifting these huge amount of subs when we were playing Pirates of the Caribbean. And I was calling you Mitch because I thought it was, um, you know, Mitch in the, in the middle is what I was picking up on. I've learned since to stop shortening names. Just use the start of it, if anything. <laughs> uh, Potterhead Katie, Revenant, Electony, thank you so much for the pits. Wet Ass Office, thank you for the five subs there as well, on top of the ten you already gave. Uh, Hibiscus, Alex, uh, Kamoran, Wilhelm, uh, Annabelle, uh, Little Glue Stick, Dandelion Ellie, thank you so much for the subs. Tisbean, thank you so much for 11 subs as well. Jesus Christ, thank you very much. Uh, Potterhead, Lexi, Litza, Voxy, Lexi again, Sumai, uh, Deck of Souls, Jazz Solo, Slincol, and Fire and Zell. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. You're very kind. <laughs> he he always calls me Marky. Uh, is it Mar Mariki? Is it? I'm sorry if I got your name wrong. <laughs> My apologies. Uh, Kelsva, thank you so much for the bits as well. Gardy, Snow So Good, thank you as well. You're very kind. Laguna. Uh, Despair, Marajax, thank you, thank you very much. Maybe stream from the sofa to have a lie down. I think I just fall asleep. <laughs> um, Alexandra, thank you so much for the tip as well. You should get notifications on Discord. You'll have to install Discord, of course, but you should get them because I, I tag everyone. Just make sure your Patreon account um, is linked or your Twitch account might be linked. Whatever it might be where you're supporting me, it has to be linked to Discord so it knows you're, you're in the supporter channel. Um... 
All right, let's get started. Epstein didn't kill himself, 69. Thank you very much for the three subs. Bloody snowman. Uh, Polar, thank you for the sub. Lovable Chester, thank you so much for the 10 subs as well. You're very, very kind. And uh, <laughs> Navi, thank you very much for the bits as well. I like that. Alexandra, thank you for the tip again. All right, let's 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 get started. Sorry, I'm, I'm a bit all over the place today. All right, so this is what we're going watching. This is Max's recommendation, so if it's bad, it's entirely his fault. Like, if it's physically painful, I don't know what it's going to be like, but... I'm new to Twitch. Well, welcome, Lottie. You'll fit right in. Don't worry. We're all boomers here. We have no idea. Max, don't even try and weasel your way out of this. Don't you start. <laughs> I love and hate it here, Max says. <laughs> all right, let's 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 jump in. Uh, let me know about the volume. I'll try and keep an eye on it if I can and try and get it right, but it might just take a second. Oh, all right. So this is a dating show based at Comic-Con. Comic-Con is the perfect place to find your geek soulmate. This is Iggy Pie. She likes to party. Oh my god, are you a brony? Oh, yes, I am. Oh my god! The girls that I really do like... Oh, we're jumping in here. I'm kind of I like hope Olwyn is here. Right now. What comics are you reading? I have a lady boner for Winter Soldiers. Oh no. All right. Strap in, everyone. <laughs> Get your cringe protection on. Quick! <laughs> you don't have much time. <laughs> Lovable Jester, thank you so much for the 10 subs again. Welcome to our universe. Oh, I gotta practice that. That's gonna be my new stream introduction, like a Kermit impression. Hmm. <laughs> Greetings, Earthlings. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> All right, Max. So far, so good. Good recommendation. Louder? I think it's pretty good now. It was quiet at the start. Kevin, no. Kevin, yes. <laughs> When you're at Comic-Con, the people in this world are different, and it shows. Nerds rule! Yes! Gamers! <laughs> I, think it's really important for I don't know why that clip was so funny. <laughs> Just that he looks kind of lost looking around. <laughs> Alright, come on gamers, we can do this. No, no, no pausing needed. Said the session, so I'm sorry if I always get your name wrong. I try my best. <laughs> Thieving, uh, killing Corgi, Yakun, Exceller, um, making my way downtown, Fiona. Thank you very much. All right, gamers, let's go. Come on. For geeks and nerds to be able to find love just yes. like it's important for everybody else. Exactly. Geeks are sexy because they're just sexy. This is 18 and over, so I can say it because they can put a lot of imagination into the bedroom. Three. Oh, two, God. One. I wasn't expecting on that. The next day. Sci-fi speed dating at Comic-Con is the perfect place uh -huh. to find your geek soulmate. Huh? Over 18? That's not You're 13. <laughs> yes. Inches. It's a, no. <laughs> around. Uh, maybe yeah. around, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Looking for guys or girls? Oh, girls, definitely. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why that's so funny. Just the comic book. The comic book, but girls, definitely. Is the thing he's saying. Oh, I don't know why that's so funny. <laughs> Faye, thank you for the tip. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. Oh. Hi, I'm Alex. I am 25, and I am a giant geek. Come on, Alex. You can do it. All I mean, the Steven. art I usually get at Comic-Con, it's all up on the walls here. Every kind of trip to Comic-Con, I usually get a lot of po art. My love life status you got it. is a mix of Forever Alone and Socially Awkward Penguin. Oh, no. It's mean-tastic. <laughs> oh, no. Characters that I love, you know. Rose Red from Fables. I'm rooting for him already. I I'm honest with you. I love redheads. Big fan of them. One of my favorites oh is my uh, this piece here. He should All go on the Irish Take Me Out. Heads. We need a reverse version. <laughs> I'm a renaissance geek. I like comics. I like board games. I love Doctor Who. And uh, Wait, I'm a also renaissance Brony. geek? So what about- Does that mean he means he's just like into everything nerdy or- like he's geeky about the the Renaissance, like Da Vinci. <laughs> I love Da Vinci. What he is is someone who watches My Little Pony. Very taste. Okay, okay yeah, I think that's is, what he uh, means. Pinkie Pie. She likes to party. So uh, this is Applejack here. Uh, she's okay. she owns a farm in the show, and uh, I like her. She's sort of the no nonsense, hardworking one. Ah, you love to see it. No nonsense, hardworking like Every myself. Thursday, I go to board game night in Brooklyn. Board games, ho. Honestly, you know, see that. 
I, this looks amazing right now. I'm not even like making fun of anyone here going to like a board game place. I don't care what it is. I'd play anything. Just human contact would be so great. <laughs> I'd happily join them now. I wouldn't have a clue what I'm doing. But <laughs> My favorite thing about board games is how it, it can bring people together. What exactly. Kind of That's I what I need. Like, uh, I mean, there's many types of nerds. So Someone, like, yeah. What, what um, type of nerd would you like? No, seriously, though. Like, what type of girl I like him. I optimally like to meet there. Yeah, I guess. I'm rooting for him. not crazy and hyper. So you essentially oh. want my non-evil twin. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I guess. That's a little creepy, Alex. <laughs> so Look at him, he's having a great girls time! Just, the girls that I just really friends, like wait, when did the Just Friends thing start? Hold on, who's the... Wait, what did I miss? No, seriously though, like what type of... Oh, oh no, don't do that to my man Alex! What the hell? That's not right. <laughs> Don't do that to him. That I really do like that. I'm really interested in. Just want to like, why did? Why couldn't you just say Alex is friends? Why the quotes? Why the quotation marks? It's just friends. <laughs> Don't do him dirty like that. Come on. I like Alex. I'm on his side. The Lomax, thank you for the sub. Lonnie, thank you for the tip as well. Um. <laughs> oh God. Lonnie, why'd you have to do that? I was just, just for those of you who are just joining us, I was saying my brain's a bit fried from all the anti antibiotics. And Lonnie gave a message with their tips saying, Confused feeling good never is. Please take a break if you need you, if need you, illness and stress if are tolling a take on your health. <laughs> it's like fucking talking to Yoda. Hmm, sure. Make the care take of and body and brain. Has anyone really been far even has decided to use, even go on to do look more like? <laughs> like, what does that mean? <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Honey, the second canon fate. Thank you very much for the tip. Oh. What kind of questions I'm rooting for Steven, ask? come on. Who's your favorite pony? <laughs> yes! Oh my god, are you a brony? Oh, yes, I am. Oh my god! Which is the hard working you know one again? Up there with MMOers, right? No, it is. Yes, MMOers? <laughs> Wait, hold on. I thought it would go like MMOers, bronies, right? I would think bronies is like. I, I'm not hating, by the way, just so you're you're aware. I'm just saying, like, it, it would go more into nerd territory than MMOers. Is MMOers a word? Moers, I'm going to call them. I, like, I'm not much of a mower myself, but I don't understand why mowers are... Uh, you know what? It and doesn't I'm matter. So, okay, I'm going to pretend I'm sitting here and I'm cosplaying as Neil Gaiman's death, okay? <laughs> so you would come well, up to me. Some of my challenges with girls are just... Talking to some of them. He seems to be doing great in there. Hi, my name is Alex. I'm Carolyn. Nice to meet you, Carolyn. Nice to meet you too. So I, I oh guess you're into Neil Gaiman, but the uh, I lovable do. gesture. Yeah. Thank you for I really that. Like all of his comics. What kind of comics do you like? Very uh, kind. I'm, I'm a big fan of comics. What else are you into? I like ponies. That's cool. I like My Little Pony too. Are you making fun <laughs> of him? <laughs> That'd be perfect, wouldn't it? Hopefully, you know, I meet Maybe someone not. there no, that they're I just, really do like. They're that just I'm really friends. In. You know, just hopefully friends. it's not some half-hearted thing. You know, that's like, oh no. God, they do like her. Hopefully I'm loving Steven. I think he's great. Because then it's just, there's no point. You don't want to. That's called stalking then. Don't do it. Don't you do it. <laughs> what was that? Go on, Alex. What's great about geek love is you could be yourself. Yo, send him. Isn't the idea of really Comic Con is you are not being yourself? I don't, oh my god, that's Steven. He's right there. Geeks and nerds to be able to find love. Go on, Steven. Just like it's important for everybody else. Nobody really wants to be alone. Here come the potential men. Is he like the leader? What I hope comes out of this is a date. Any date. I think any date, maybe. Guys, leave all your bags and stuff over there by that table. Under As the table. Dipper. Oh, I didn't even uh, realize. Like red hair, a unique face. You know, someone who doesn't look like everyone else, maybe. Move on in. Okay, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Sci-Fi Speed Dating. Ladies, right. do not use this as an exercise to perfect your friend zoning technique. <laughs> the friend zone is he like their sucks. leader? He seems like and their escaping leader. Escaping the friend zone is like threading a needle while jumping on a pogo stick, evading sharks with frickin' laser beams attached to their frickin' heads. Dates are three a minutes long. A lot of frickins being dropped, minutes, though. Get up and rotate. Ladies, please have a seat. It would be great if I could find the perfect match, someone I like, someone who likes me, maybe. But I'm, I'm open to see what's going to happen. <laughs> no, I'm All right, scared. Three, two, 
Speed date. He does so, kind of look I like Gabe Newell. You're right. <laughs> I just see Max. Why did you do this to us in the chat? <laughs> City lights, no brain gamer, blue mountain, otter, brookie, powerful pair, R2, moving fortress, Jaffa, green eggs and bacon. Um, Hannah, Midnight's Dawn, thank you for the two subs, and Meowers, thank you for the sub. Uh, Gabe, been, yeah, Gabe so, Newell. How are you enjoying Comic-Con so far? The How are you enjoying Comic-Con so far? Thank you. It's tough at first, you know, it's like... <laughs> Hi. So, I'm wearing a Russian shirt, so I'm kind of like nervous sitting around you right now. No, I'm not, what? I'm not gonna die, don't oh, worry. Oh, okay, red shirts are Star Trek characters who die frequently, thank you. Hope you don't either. Yeah, no, I hope not. Yeah. <laughs> I love that intro. I hope you don't die. Yeah, I hope you don't die either. I take that as a plus. That is the small talk that we're going to go back to when things go back to normal. We're all going to be bad at it. Alex is a very classical styled geek. He knows what he is and he's proud of it. I like him. So, what are you into? I'm into everything. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> that's really hard to follow up to. What are you into? Everything. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. I love everything too. You like music? Yep. <laughs> What's your favorite band? I just like all music. <laughs> it's so hard to make a conversation out of it. I will play board games. Cool. Oh my god, the ears are moving. You know, it's like I'm sort of trying to take it as I go. Go on, Alex. I work in the health education. Has anyone here done speed dating? And if so, what is it like? I imagine it must be strange. I, I, it must be a strange experience. Okay. Health ed teacher, putting condoms on bananas. You have, Max, that's true, that's true. <laughs> I forgot about that. Things like that, it's always fun. It always, you know, shocks people when you pull the banana out, but hey. <laughs> Wait, what was she saying? Uh, what's the weirdest museum you've been to? The sex museum. <laughs> <laughs> fandom doesn't have to match mine, but it, you know, it wouldn't hurt if we matched a little bit. I love the Kirby shirt. Thank you. Do and they have like questionnaires? And it said dirty humor. Yeah. <laughs> I like that she had a, uh, you know, you know, sexually funny Kirby shirt on. Uh, but I want you inside maybe. Uh, video games? Yeah. Have you played Journey on PS3? <laughs> I love it. Oh my gosh. Awesome. Cool. I love else. it. So he seemed really interested in what I do, um, and and he was really nice. It was very fun talking with her. You know, I felt very comfortable with her. Oh, it was really nice. Alex is doing all right. He yeah, seems social. Yeah. Hi, Idris. Oh, you know who I am. Of course. Okay. Let me like make some Grumpy notes on like. Yeah. yeah. They know each other's characters! And they, they even did a normal high five. Oh my god, that Batman in the background was fucking terrifying. <laughs> What's the difference between you and me? I'm wearing hockey pants. <laughs> I love them. This just looks so scary. Is it the bionic arm that does it or I love it. I hope he's in another episode. His ass polarity attitude though. The bad boy attitude, got it. That's sort of a that's like catnip for women, isn't it? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. She's looking for a Still bad boy. Uh, you know, so far some of the girls are great. So what are you into? Batman. Batman, Batman, Batman. Oh, Batman. I have got the perfect Batman for you. <laughs> He's just sitting in the background like... <laughs> All-time favorite love me characters. Great costume though. How long did it take you? He was a huge fan of Batman and Harley, so that always gets me Oh, going. she's Harley. I didn't even realize. Quiet, please, and sit down. Sci-fi speed dating scoreboard. Wait, so they're scoring each person? Is that the sheets they're drawing on? Yes, it was three minutes. I know you're not used to going that long, but it's okay. You've been keeping track? Of this the guy's going to get mutinied. Like, he's their current leader, but I can sense discontent among the group. Scorecards, yes. Oof. When I'm done talking, you're going to find the pieces of paper that correlate to the people that you liked. If you like number five, you'll find number five's page. It'll say number five on it. Right. If you didn't like somebody, don't write anything down. Okay, fair warning. Some of you are gonna get no numbers. It happens. Oh, I apologize no. in advance. This better Just not mean happen. It wasn't session for you. All right, write your stuff down. Go. Uh, my heart's gonna be fucking broken. Uh, like really honestly. I like so many of them. I like the girl with Come the on, uh, Alex. shirt. I like the girl on the uh, starts to cute too. I like the one that was dressed up as Harley. Who knows though? The ones I like are the ones that everyone likes, of course. So I'm gonna go put my name and number down. And see Come what on, happens. Alex. Please Gentlemen, don't do this to me, look pretty, Steven. Pop sorry. All right, ladies, <laughs> this is yes. what we call the perfect match. This is a chance for oh, you guys no. and gals. Oh, this is so much pressure. I don't, 
I need him to find someone. Like, I can't explain how much I need this to happen. <laughs> Zian, uh, Peacemaker, Christian, uh, Portent, uh, Big Red, Seraphy, Backdoor Buddha, uh, Hyperion, Fl Flamboy, and Lonnie, thank you as well. To get three minutes with somebody that liked you, that you liked back, okay? It's hard to know if I've left an impression on the Please. one that I'd like, you know, it's sort Come of, on, so it's a tough thing. Ladies, do you have your perfect match in sight? Okay. What do they do now? On their hormonal signals. You need to run to him as fast as possible right now. Go. Oh no! Come on, please. No, please. If you do not have a perfect match, it's okay. Quickly, quickly. Come on. Yes! Hey. Yes! I'm actually, Alex. So I probably. You know, oh yes! I'm okay. so happy. I was oh, I was, was so know, worried for a second. Like, so. Yes! yes. <laughs> the eyes, I'm yeah, so happy. Match. Congratulations. That's really something cool in this thing right here. Take this time. And they seem the like they really Maybe liked each other. Time to hang out this weekend. How old are you as well? I'm, I'm 24. 25, nice, good. There's the like one 32 year old that still lives with his mom. I was like, no. I kind of live with my folks still. Yeah, you know? but it, I don't know. I it's feel like, like in the 20s, oh, it's okay. No. Because yeah, no. especially the economy sucks. So, uh, reasonable. You want to some time after this? Uh, yeah, sure. Um, but I've got a little bit of time right now if you want to yeah, keep we chatting. Could, I could, we could walk around, uh, you know. Yeah. Got, they can walk you back to your booth as well. <laughs> yes. <laughs> cool, thanks. I mean, it's like... You can do it yourself, of course, but you, but, you know, if you want, yeah. you want the company. <laughs> okay. But like, for some reason, this is adorable. Like, I don't know, on the Take Me Out ones, the dating show you watch in the Irish one, they'd be like, yeah, that's the sh 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 shifters. And then they go to shifters and they're just sitting there awkwardly like, ah, you're a bit of crack. Uh, great, yeah. You're a bit of crack too, and it's just awkward. Like they, they seem like they have like a bit of chemistry going. <laughs> I don't going. know. I, I'm hopeful. I like her, and I, you know, she kind of picked me, so I'm, I'm excited about that. I'm so happy. Yeah. I was literally devastated. <laughs> like I actually was devastated when no one was coming over. Good so grammar happy. and spelling are important. Ah, sure, but yeah. Good grammar, good spelling, good spell bit of crack. Spell. All right, come on. Let's continue on with the rest of the episode, shall we? We still, oh, we're still focusing on them. Come on. Okay. Be married with five kids in the suburbs. So, yeah. What happened after speed dating was that after talking to Kate, basically on camera, uh, cameras were off, and we walked away, and what happened was that basically uh, she told me after about a minute no. basically that she just wanted to be friends. So basically no. kind of, uh, nothing ever happened, of course. I understand, but it, it was kind of depressing. You know, it's me, I guess. That's, that's my no. life. No, no, Steven! I'm actually devastated. Was, uh, pretty bad, but the rest of the con was great. I got to meet basically uh, Bill Willingham, from, who did who writes for Fables. It was awesome. He All right, well, at least he got that. He sent his awesome piece of art that was free. You know, I got a lot of. I'm art. so I'm upset. That, <laughs> I'm actually so upset. Like. <laughs> Anyone of you uh, watching like what they see? Contact me. This was a long studio. time ago. I hope he's found his 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 geek. Okay. Oh, this was too right. raw. That was too yeah. raw. No, don't come up with your feckin' company logo. Now is not the time. <laughs> God damn it. Why did it have to be a sad ending? I really had high hopes for that. We got, we're moving on to Casey Ann now. So I think how it works is it's the same... It's the same instance that we just watched, but now it focuses on someone else and it goes through different people. Oh, Max. God damn it. Why'd you do this to us? <laughs> uh, Lonnie, as I meant, unrepent, uh, Alexandra, Potterhead, a wild... A wild wham wampert, blind bandit, Effie and Navi. Thank you very much as well. All right, let's go. Episode two, this is gonna be happy. Single? Yes. Guys or girls? Both. Casey is right. wearing very little. I really wanna find love where someone Why didn't loves you pick Alex? Just as much as get I rid of annoying I'm ads. actually really excited to see the reaction we get from the guys here at Speed Dating Over. I think they're gonna go for it. I don't know if there's anybody that I really have connected with. Anywhere you want, real life. Come on. waiting to talk to you. Real life women? <laughs> what? 
What? <laughs> the horse is so gross. Yeah, the, it, why is it a trend, huh? <laughs> Navi, thanks for the gifted sub. And Dr. Blindsy, thank you for the bits too. All right, this is going to be good. We got this. Hey, you know, Kermit the Frog here. Welcome to Geek Love. <laughs> Yay! I love geeks. No. <laughs> It's going to be that every time. I feel like that's his only impression. He's going to keep pulling it out. <laughs> I would like to find some geek love. That would be nice. Somewhere I forgot Lollipop Chainsaw was a game. Remember that game? When did it come out? Like 2010 or something? I never actually played it. Should I add that to my list? I don't know what it's about. Shares the hmm. same things that you do. I don't think it's hard for geeks and nerds to find love. I think it's hard for geeks and nerds to find places to meet to fall in love. There you Over go. 18. Yes. Single? Yes. Guys or girls? Both. Single? Guys why, girls. Wait. Okay. Over 18. Why did Single? they Why did they speed up just to like one second he took taking a step? Yes. Guys or girls? Both. <laughs> they like they time lapse it for two feet. <laughs> so weird. Guys or girls? I like guys. You like guys? Why? Too, but not enough what? to date a girl. Girls are nice. I'm really confused. Why wouldn't they be single? Yeah, he has to go through. It's like his sense of honor. He has to go through like, are you single though? Because if you're not, you shouldn't be here. <laughs> it's just so weird. I have He's been... just super fast. Not only can he do a great Carmen impression, he can move at the speed of light. A geek, particularly a game geek, since I was about two years old. My God, she's a Casey lot of memorabilia. I'm, I'm pretty geeky. <laughs> Right All right. now, I'm playing Lollipop Chainsaw. Oh, that's just, that's the game! I used to be babysat by my grandmother, and she had a NES. The game looks I weird. Is it just a beat him up or what? I play The Legend of Zelda. So, <laughs> I started gaming back then, and I just kind of never stopped. <laughs> Pauldrons. They're pretty uh, fantastic when you're trying to walk indoors. Being a geek makes it tough to find a good guy. Is she like proper into cosplay? I've whenever I see costumes like this, like I've been to a few gaming conventions, and it's just like how much time goes into this? It must be like literally a year of of building. As a lot of geeky guys are either intimidated. How by old me is this show? I think it's 2013. It was based, so I guess the game came out about there. To prove I'm a geek, so that makes it kind of tough to find somebody. Oh, that chainsaw. was awful! Yes, that squeak! And the boyfriend. Oh. <laughs> don't really date so much. Oh. I have found love before, but it wasn't reciprocated. So Aww. at this point, I really want to find love where somebody loves me. You've got this. Just as much as I love Casey. them. Casey. <laughs> Check the name. <laughs> oh, that squeak though. Okay, I uh, I reckon she's a good chance, right? I love nerds. <laughs> nerds love me. <laughs> oh no! Wake up, get up, get the chance to meet one and all. I think one of the big reasons oh. sci-fi speed dating is becoming so successful is <laughs> people are starting to realize that it's not a joke. Are we also calling I mean, her Steven? Now we consistently turn away hundreds, if not thousands, of people. What? but I'm excited at the same time. <laughs> okay, now, the dates are three minutes long. Oh, Every no. three minutes, the guys will stand up and cycle Come on, on to the Steven. next date. You will have a scorecard I'm on just your bracing chair myself. with a pen. Use it to keep track of the people you like. It's hard to say what the person sitting across from me at speed dating will see as my best quality, especially because I'm going to be in costume. Hopefully it's not, like my cleavage or something awkward like that. Go talk to Steven. Oh, well, I know they're all like Steven. <laughs> Go talk to Alex, right? Gentlemen, if you're here just to get laid, please leave. Ladies, if you're here just to get laid, take your pick. 
I think Casey Ann is a geek head. I feel like this guy's doing this show for him. <laughs> it's like a launch pad for his career on Irish Take Me Out. <laughs> He's gunning for that position. Jesus Christ. I think they're going to go They're cut from the same cloth. they're going to make a valiant effort at dating her. Oh, there's Alex. Alex is going to be like the fan favorite, isn't he? Three. There's Batman. <laughs> He's the new fan favorite. This must be so awkward. Speed date. Anywhere the thing is, I think it would be a bit less awkward if it weren't so like, like they're just in an empty room, obviously, because it's a con. You got some posters up and some sheets down. Like if it was in like a more warm atmosphere, it might not be as awkward, but they're just sitting there. No table, just fold out stools. Real live women waiting to talk to you. <sighs> I want us to hear from Batman. Um, so what do you do? One of 30. Is that too personal? Oh no, I just mean in regards to what? Oh no. <laughs> oh, professionally. I'm a lawyer. I'm a lawyer, wow. <laughs> no! Oh, Casey, no! I don't think they have chemistry. Can we make this speed dating a bit speedier? This is over. This it might be jitters. The first one, it's it's catching her off guard. It's all right. We're fine. So like Twenty nine to go. Very nice. I love it too. <laughs> Casey is dressed oh, no. as a lollipop chainsaw, but she's wearing very little and. Hopefully, she will reveal a lot of herself. What? Oh my god, he's actually worse than Ray, for fuck's sake. I didn't think it was possible, but he's actually worse than Ray. How is that humanly possible? He's done it somehow. Oh, there's Batman again. <laughs> Why is he always pulling the weird faces? <laughs> for fuck's sake, like. Oh. What would you say is your favorite game? Oh no. Legend of Zelda. Yay, me too! <laughs> so far... Oh no, this is so intense. This is so intense. I, it's, oh, it's just eye contact and chewing. <laughs> I'm gonna do that as my next stream. The title's literally gonna be eye contact and chewing. I'm just chewing gum. Yeah, the whole time. It's been fun. Nobody oh. has asked me yet if I've actually played this video game, so that's a good sign. <laughs> Zombie lollipop chainsaw. Yeah, you got there it. you go, you got it. Did you play that? Of course I did. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, I got it. I got it. <laughs> lollipop chainsaw. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> did you play that? I did. <laughs> I've been meeting some nice people. I don't know if there's anybody that I really have connected with or anything, though. So I don't know who I would pick. Do you know who I am? If I was going to guess, I would say your Mortal Kombat. Yes, good job. Um, and uh, you're a lot of people. It's too Yeah, they made me leave the <laughs> It works way too well. Oh no! <laughs> it kind of works. Oh. So, Casey, come on, Casey. Speedy little guy who was very physically fit, you know, very pumped, iron-looking, good-looking guy. Oh no, this dude! He keeps doing his impressions, <laughs> and he's already on our bad side. But now he keeps forcing his impressions on us. Oh, what's his name? I don't know what his name is, but this is hard. Where checks that you were the bits. This is never make that specific chewing sound ever again. I'm Patriarch, thank you for the sub. Dex, Gobby, Backdoor, thank you very much, folks, for the support. Right. Jim Billy, superhero, the Schwarzenegger style, you know. And um, he seemed like he was completely unfazed by her looks. His eyes were always looking at eyes. He was never. So you oh, prefer no, he's awful. Well, my true love as far as video games is actually Zelda, so... Uh, there's Batman. Zelda fan too. So I haven't played any of, like, the new ones on the new world, like, the Wii system. Do you not have a Wii? Do not have a Wii. Right? Let's not talk about my lack of Wii. <laughs> <laughs> Pleasure meeting you, 22. Nice to meet you. 22, and you were 24. I'm wondering if I should just take a chance and write something down, so, or... 
not because I'm afraid. So unless I know that I'm super sure, I'm just hesitant. So how does it work? Is it... Hmm. I'm trying to figure out how the, the sheets work. I want to know how well Batman did. We all do. We all do. Thank you so much for the follows as well, folks. I appreciate it. So they're their scores. They're matching the scores. Okay, so say they matched each other on their, their cards and they're like, yep, me like. It's just like a paper Tinder. And then I guess this host here, Kermit, wants to match them up and be like, okay, you both match. Take this sheet. And then at the end, they go to the people sitting down if they want to. I think that's it. It's basically like paper tinder. Okay, thank you, Max, resident expert. <laughs> All right, ladies, go to that table. Gentlemen, you will stand up and go to that table. Hopefully, okay. you've been keeping track of the people you liked on your scorecards. Of the people that you liked, you will write the number on your chest, your first name, and either your cell phone or your email address. Nothing else. The what? perfect match is just a chance to get three more minutes with somebody that you liked, that liked you back. I think the perfect match is kind of a huge moment because like- Could you say you this actually... in an impression, please? <laughs> You're losing my interest. Be seeing the start of a forever relationship. Okay, ladies, head over there real quick and grab the papers that are yours. If you're 11, you grab 11. I hope you all okay. have your perfect match in sight. Okay, so yeah, it, it had her number on it. Puts it down the table, everyone who's going through all the sheets goes, yeah, 11. And then just writes their name and number, I guess. Okay. You need to run to him as fast as possible right now, go. Hi. Oh, oh, they found their match. They seem to have yeah, chemistry. Yeah. You tell me about your archaeology. Yeah, that's what I'd like to do, ideally, but I know that that's kind of difficult to break into. But like, are you studying into that right now? Yep, I'm studying. Um, they seem to have a bit of chemistry. Archaeology specific courses before I graduate. I like that you're, like, you're studying archaeology. Like, I wouldn't suspect that, you know? Yeah. <laughs> they caught me off guard. I'm going to go to the costume contest tonight. Yeah, I'll join you. Because okay. I was going to do that too. Oh, 6.30, right? Yeah. yeah. A match! For our date, we're going to go to the costume contest. Oh, ain't that nice. Seems like it could be a good fit, and I'm hoping that it goes well tonight. <laughs> I love your iPad. <laughs> Thank you so much. Wait, what? iPad. Tonight. I love your iPad. <laughs> Thank you so much. I, I thought he said I love you, but I think he said something else. I couldn't quite catch it. I was like, oh no. <laughs> it's going so well. I don't know. What, what did he say? I don't think it was I love you. I love your outfit or something. I was thinking maybe like that. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. I don't think he said I love you. He said I love something... Eye color? It could have been eye color. Lollipop outfit? It could have been. I love your Batman costume. Yeah, that must have been what he said. <laughs> Why does she have a head? Apparently, she was saying earlier that in the game, that the character goes around with uh, her boyfriend's head or something like that. A dead boyfriend, I would assume, unless he's somehow alive. Uh, Lottie, Aunt, uh, Megan, Hazel, uh, Benuta, Marichax, thank you as well. <laughs> Appreciate it. I have high hopes for this couple. Thank you so much for the follows as well, everyone. How's everything? Good, good. Oh my god. Yeah, Such a soft too. spoken voice out of that costume. Oh, they're even going up together. Oh, they did a little thing together. That's great. Easy well, clap, some, right? Cool stuff for them. I yeah. love it. It makes them smile. I love it. <laughs> it's like it's for the fans, really. <laughs> or something, and it just yeah. makes them so happy. Oh, yeah. I love it. You did really good on this. Like, you made <laughs> I love this outfit. Yeah. <laughs> he bought the same fake beard. Put it on here and here. It's, it's really great. Crazy. I love it. Like, I need to get on your level. <laughs> like, I am so off that. They put in so much effort into their costumes. Oh, my God. They're even doing Just Dance. Just Dance, um, he actually managed to get me on the stage dancing, <laughs> which is a pretty difficult feat because I am the best dancer ever, as I'm sure it was I think they're great together. 
my first date was actually pretty cool. Like, ah, he's delighted. To be like this, but it was really nice. I, I like her so much. Like, I would like to like maybe see if we could go on another one. No, I think ah, isn't that lovely? Just, you know, have you ever played that before? <laughs> okay, then you did awesome. I haven't been on too many dates ever, but this. Oh is my God, Slenderman looking really right into the camera. <laughs> It's just staring. This is great. I just hope episode three is about Batman because that's what we're all interested in. We dance. We did costuming stuff. So super nerdy and just about everything that I like. The head is so <laughs> creepy. Ah, look at him. <laughs> She's so annoying walking around with the sword. Um, oh. So after speed dating, Alex and I did keep in touch through Facebook. He has actually gone on to um, find someone though. He's in a relationship and not with me. And that's okay. And I'm super okay. happy for him. Okay. And I honestly have no doubt that I'll find someone. Yes. I'm definitely yes, queen. more open to dating now. And I've kind of let go of the idea that a date is necessarily an indicator that you're going to be in a relationship. Like dating can just be fun. I you know follow- what? And maybe it's overall still a good thing. She seems like she's happy for him and all this. And also, maybe it was like a learning experience, you know? Comic-Con. With Comic-Con. <laughs> so, I will be back next year. And who knows? Maybe I will do speed dating again. We'll see what the future holds. <laughs> there you go. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger and all that, right? Are we on to episode three? Where is... It's it's Brittany now. This is a new character. I don't think we've seen Brittany in the background of anything. I just want to see Batman. Unless that is Batman. <laughs> that would be a hell of a plot twist. <laughs> I'd be so happy. Luna, thank you very much for the tip. Hiccuping Dog, thank you for the sub. Lottie, thank you as well. Oh, thank you as well. Uh, and Megan said, Ray, please come back. I'll never complain again. You see, sometimes you're better off with the devil you know rather than the devil you don't know. <laughs> All right, time for Steve 3. Assessio <laughs> nerd. Oh, it's a Harry Potter nerd. At least I'll get the references now. She's a video game geek. These are the only friends I have in New York City. (laughs) It's very hard to meet people that you have common interests with. I love video games, particularly Bioware. Bioware. What do Bioware do again? Is that Destiny? Uh, Why am I blanking? All right. Less of the host, Sci-fi speed more romance. Really successful. We had a couple that met at our very first session. They just got married. This is the place to come. They got if married. You want to meet somebody special at Comic Con. Mass Effect is it? Anthem. Let's stick to Mass Effect. Geeks rule. Over eighteen. Yes. Single. Yes. Looking for guys or girls. Guys. Does okay. he do this every time? Oh, they didn't even give her a quote this time. What city is this? It looks cool. I said, it... "What is this? What city? This? Tell me. <laughs> is it Cork? <laughs> I think like this building would be the tallest building in Ireland if this was Cork. It's New York. Okay. I'd be bad at GeoGuessr right now. <laughs> come up, come up. What game is that? Oh, Fallout. Yeah, Doing My a bit of a let's Brittany. play. I am 22 years old, and during the day I am a kindergarten teacher, and at night I am a nerd. Here is <laughs> Dragon Age, one of my favorite games. Oh, this of all is time. why Brittany I likes. A because I really love video Bioware. games. I've been playing since I was three years old. I also find myself into the geek fandoms a lot. I have okay. my Harry Potter ones. I have Hermione's wand, who's my favorite character from Harry Potter. And we also have my own wand. From this isn't looking good. Like, I have one of these wands. <laughs> I'm not happy right now. <laughs> it was a gift, all right? Universal but still. Studios, <laughs> world. Oh, no. <laughs> the cameraman is now uh, dead. Star Wars. <laughs> this little guy is my Jawa, you know. I'm really looking for um, intelligent nerd. Uh, I also built my Should've own Should have picked Alex. Because if you're a gamer, you have to have your own beast of a gaming machine. I have, you know, 16 gigs of RAM, 3.4 CPU. My video card... <laughs> it sounds like, you know, when you watch shows like The Big Bang and they're like, let's just say like RAM and gigahertz. <laughs> then it'll be nerdy. You know? <laughs> it's kind of okay. I like it. DTI. And the guy that I'm going to be with... Brady knows a lot more about her computer than I know about mine. 
I've only had one serious long-term relationship, but we were high school sweethearts and we just weren't meant for each other. And as a romantic at heart, I knew that wasn't what I was looking for. And I'm really looking for my soulmate. How and old is this? 2013. City, I really haven't found anyone that I really want to go on a date with. So I haven't been on a date in a long time. What would give you a nerdgasm? A nerdgasm? Uh, Why don't you call them games, that? Do you have any deal breakers? They have to play video games. Is that honestly your deal breaker? It is. That's a serious problem. <laughs> I'm trying to find oh, no. someone who has the same passions as I do. Oh, no. So when we're 70 years old, sitting in our rocking chairs and we're old farts, that we can talk about the newest comic or the latest shenanigans that's come out on the Xbox 20. It is good to Oh God, if only you knew friend. what Excellent. route they went with the consoles. <laughs> if only they did go like Xbox 1, 2, 3, 4 and all the way up to 20. By speed dating, I'm trying to find who uh, go on, Brittany. We're rooting for Brittany. All the contestants have been great. The only one we don't like so far is the host, really. <laughs> was sexy. Um. Yeah, wait, what was that? Besides everything, I like FYI, not a good comic book head. What is? <laughs> I'm a nerd. You're a nerd. You're like I don't know what like comic you're talking things. about. Like Did I mention things. a comic? I don't know. <laughs> At Comic Con, it's awesome. Bring Girls, us come Ray. On in. This is above his is pay grade. The kindergarten teacher. <laughs> I'm just gonna go with the flow today. You know, I'm excited. I'm just gonna see what happens. Gentlemen, do not start talking. Thank you, Joby, for joining the stream. The girls, yet? Yeah? You'll scare them. <laughs> So we've got Brittany. She's a video game geek. She's a teacher. She's oh, no. beautiful. She seems really nice. The guys are going to be all over. All right, guys. Everybody ready? Yeah. Three. I'm just waiting for him to say something awful. Oh, <laughs> there it is. I was like, why is he not said anything awful or cringy yet? But there, he, he got it in there somewhere. I'll give Good you job. I'm a myself. I am a teacher. I love Marvel. Oof. Myself. Okay. Uh, I love video games, particularly Bioware. I like the shows Once Upon a Time, Lost, Doctor Who, like anime, oh, no. Dark Ball Z, Tenshi Muyo. I'm a teacher. He's I confused. I love the shows Once Upon a Time, Lost. Um, oh no, I think she's got the wrong strategy here. He said what? Yeah, I think he just went, what? <laughs> I think she's kind of got the, um, you know, kind of talking at you kind of thing. I think she's just trying to get it all out there. Like it's, it's speed dating, so I get it, you know? But I'm thinking maybe as we go in a few, we'll be fine. Doctor Who. I just love talking to fellow nerds. I love video games, particularly <laughs> Bioware, comic books, Marvel. You can do it, Brittany, uh, come on. I love the show, it's once upon a time, Doctor Who. You know, guys <laughs> in this are already nervous, so when you get a girl that, right off the bat, she's wide open, she's in close, that might have scared some of the guys off. Hi. I usually tend to speed find myself dating, like. to uh, skinnier nerds. I don't know why, um, but that's my cup of tea. All right, so I'll go through the rundown. I love 14. video games, particularly Bioware. I'm anime, Dragon Ball Z, Tenshi Muyo. I'm a teacher, and uh, you know Harry Potter, Star Wars, Lord of the Rings. You're good. <laughs> <laughs> I Finally, good. someone who appreciates how fast she's speed running this. Okay. <laughs> He's 14. No, 14 is like the, the number they're on. 14 out of 30. I do what you do. Okay, let's do it. I'm in comic oh, books. Okay. Um, I like sci-fi. The Department of Master Galactic, uh, Firefly, that kind of stuff. And I work in addiction medicine. <laughs> She's a speedrunner. <laughs> she really is. That's awesome. So you like really helping people. So. I do, yeah. yeah. I wish I could have talked a little bit more, but I guess that's why it's called speed dating. It is indeed, but you're doing well on time. Hi, number one. How are you? Good. Oh my god, this you? is number one. You're number 30? Well, I'll give you the rundown. I work in the defense industry as a software engineer. That's awesome. Huge fan of video games. I played all the Mass Effect games. Uh -huh. I love video games, Bioware particularly. I'm a teacher. Steven, number I love 14. The shows Lost, Once Upon a Time. I think that's Doctor the one. Who. Where is Batman? I think we are all asking ourselves that. Where is Batman? I love Marvel. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Well, it was a pleasure meeting you. Nice meeting you too. 
I thought she was attractive and How long do they have? Three minutes? She's got a great job. You know, she was very outgoing and direct to the point. And I like that. If she doesn't pick me, I'm not going to be upset. But if she does pick me, hey, it's awesome. <laughs> Hi. Good, how are you? Oh, God, what is this you? character? Are you an anime character, right? No, I, have so, I mean, I, you know, it's funny because I feel oh, like no. anything that isn't one thing you don't readily recognize. Is it video game? No, it's it's Ariel game. It's it's me. It's who it's who I am. Okay. I All right. So what do you do? So Come on now. <laughs> Come on. Like, you're dressed like that and you're offended that someone thinks it's a costume? Like, you just say, no, no, I just have a quirky style. You don't have to get defensive over it. Like... Flowers, design. Design. Oh! Designer. Oh, no. He was extremely defensive. <laughs> she should have just went out. Ah, you know what? Why don't we just sit here in silence for a few minutes? <laughs> stand up and go to that table and touch nothing. All right, here we go. Go to that table and touch nothing, and then refocus on me. That's what he wants. He wants all the focus on him. That's him. It's gonna be number fourteen, right? Seven. It's Gucci. 11, you wouldn't understand. <laughs> something with several people so I'm interested to see where it goes how much did she say did she say seven people now I need you to get your papers go to something with your perfect match right now go oh no oh god basement cool thank you so much for the 10 subs that's very very kind of you Andy Lord Gagey K uh Marita thank you as well um yeah I <laughs> I I was thinking about doing kind of a catch-up video soon yeah I've not done one in a while um, you see, you have Bob's uh, laughter, uh, Rosie, Luna, thank you very much, and uh, Base McGill, thank you so much for the 10 again. 1 or 14? I think it's going to be 14. They seem to have a connection, you know, based on the five seconds I saw them talking. What? Number one! I'm Brittany. I it's thought it was 14. Yeah, I just moved into a new place. I bought a condo, so oh, wow. I've been so busy, like, trying to unpack everything. Oh, I moved here, like, a couple months ago. It's a nightmare. I'm not upset or anything. I'm in the city a lot, so I don't mind traveling, you know. When he first came in, he was one of the yeah. ones that I really was, like, attracted this, to. I'm like, happy for them. Like, look at them. Look, look how like, upfront they are. This is great. I got my heart beating a little bit. I'm happy. Well, I liked, I, she was very direct with me. <laughs> she was like, I like this, this, and this. And I'm like, oh, yeah, I like some of that stuff, too. Nice. I'm kidding. I'm happy for them, okay? Jesus, these are flying. Oh, but please let them be an actual couple after this. I can't handle that we decided to just be friends anymore. The next so, day. First day, a little nervous, a little excited. Yes! Hey. They're meeting up! Oh, hey, what's going oh, yeah, on? Good. Nice to see you. Nice to see you, yeah. So, you ready to shoot some stormtroopers? Yeah. We're going to the what are they doing? Trooper shooter troop. Can't beat that, right? I know it's really popular. I have high hopes. It's a lifelong dream, right? I know. I'm a little nervous, you know. I think it's gonna be a good time. Thank you. All right. I like how it's all kids in the line. I love that. Have the confidence to do what you want to do. You get your pictures. I'm you move. I love the guy with the camera too. <laughs> Possibly be my best friend and have a romantic interest in. But this is the guy. Hi, nice, nice to, meet to meet you. you. We're Who's this? Picture. Sure, yeah. have a seat. So. Oh, picture. Okay, I thought they were getting tattoos, and I was like, Jesus, that's a bit soon. <laughs> I was What's a bit your worried. Sci-fi or fantasy movie? I really liked The Fountain. I don't know if you could consider I that. I love The Fountain. It what was, was so on? good. I'm like, so out so of deep. my like, depth here. Oh I don't know God. any of these. See, like most people I talk to, they're either like, this is amazing, or they hate it. We just compliment each other because we're both nerdy and I'm I think liking we're both this. For the same thing. This is going well. I'm a pretty simple girl. Like my favorite food is like a grilled cheese sandwich, but I like that she's driven. She seems very confident. I could totally see something blossoming between us. I have a good feeling about this. I do too. <laughs> I love the geek love experience. You know, I think it's very creative and it helped me find the geek. Are you hungry? I'm kind of hungry. You want to get something to eat? Yeah, I could definitely get something to eat. They must be at this point like, let's just leave this camera thing. Like, it must be making it a bit hard to get to know each other when this guy's following him around, like, <laughs> all the time. 
good grilled cheese sandwich. Yes, he's they're and, leaving. Yeah, definitely. Well, Spider Man, I think they made it. Hi. Come on. This is my update and what's been going on with Luke and I. Um, you know, we've gone on several dates. Yes. We went to see a movie. It's a nice wine, and we had a lot of fun. And Geek Love was a great experience. Yes. It definitely affected my love life. I'm looking forward to seeing him again. Thanks, Geek Love. Bye. Happy ending, finally. Jesus. <laughs> Oh, I just wow! Oh, I wish Alex got one too. He deserved. I wish they all did, but you know, Alex just—he just, you know, he got me so invested in his story. <laughs> Cater boy, thank you so much for the five subs. That is the oil. Uh, Vorty, I uh, didn't hear it. Thank you very much as well. Bunky, call me majestic trash, and uh, Froggy, thank you as well. Sorla, thank you as well. All right, shall we move on? Episode four. Everything Steven. in life is a negotiation. When you cross the street is a negotiation. <laughs> Getting your they coffee. go really quick, don't they? Or is it just me? <laughs> oh, hello, Kip. I only saw you there. I'm Sorry. And I am a How are you doing? Geek. Jimmy looked like what I would expect Jimmy Olsen of 2012 to look like. I'm always hoping that I'm going to meet the woman of my dreams. You don't know Hold who on. Jimmy Olsen is? Yeah. Do you know who that is? No. You don't know who Jimmy Olsen is? No. Who's Jimmy what Olsen? What the hell is going on? Who's... Who's Jimmy Olsen? Can someone fill me in? Is it Batman? <laughs> Superman's friend? Wait, why would you want to be Superman's friend? Does he become a Superman? Or just... Is he like a sidekick or just... Oh, he's a... a jealous Jimmy. <laughs> he's just a reporter. Is it? Okay, fair enough. Uh, it, it's... Okay. It came again, is it? Thank you very much for the five subs. I'm sorry I'm messing up your name, but thank you very much for that. Uh, Andre, Charge, Luna, Cam, thank you as well. Thank you for that. Is it a Camexagon? Thank you very much. And Moran, thank you for the, for the eight as well. Please show more Batman. Dating normal people sucks. So you, you gotta find the people in your world. You have to find your inner geek. And I helped her bring her geek out. Over 18? What costumes were they wearing? Guys or girls or cheerleaders? Cheerleaders. All right. Over 18? Yes. Single? Yes. Guys or girls? Ladies. Ladies? Oh, yeah. Impressive, Mr. Olsen. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm Jimmy. So I'm it's years like old. it's bad when you start, you start wishing Ray was hosting the show, you know? And I'm a huge superhero geek. I've got this little miniature Tom Welling from Smallville Superman figure that I'm working on. Uh, it's got the full costume and I got the Wait, head on he made eBay it? somewhere. And I've actually created uh, you know, a full cape that I'm hopefully going to attach. Oh my god, someday. there's something creepy about the body parts of Superman lying just disjointed all over the place though. I'm really interested in Superman <laughs> and the mythology of that character and the movies and the comics and pretty much anything related to the Man of Steel. I've even got a Superman tattoo. Oh my god, he's even got a tattoo. Uh, this is I a don't Superman think special. I could ever get that invested with anything. Like, I, de I debated getting a tattoo at one point, but I was like, what would I even get? I don't know. I was like, I, it would be kind of cool to get something to do with, like, videos or streaming and stuff, because it's been a big part of my life, but, like, what would I get? <laughs> get YouTube written across me, a corporate logo, fantastic. Sure, I made when I was a young boy. Uh, as you can <laughs> see, I didn't quite know how to draw an the Among S Us tattoo. When yes. I was little, but I think I've gotten the hang Just of a little it now. Among Us when character. I'm... This tattoo is kind of sus. It would definitely age well. It would age like a fine milk. I was a young kid. That's when I started getting into the arts and just drawing and painting. And I think it was because I was interested in drawing Superman. I would just draw the character over and over again while I was watching these movies. God, so he's my fast. love for art kind of came from so my quick. Love for the character. So this is me as Jimmy Olsen. Every time I go to a convention, I dress up as Jimmy Olsen. Oh, gee. Chief. What? <laughs> is that what Jimmy uh, Olsen says? I was in a serious says? relationship for a couple years. Uh, it was really great. It meant a lot to me, but the breakup was so... It was just a complicated mess, and it just really kind of caused me not to want to trust anybody. So okay. I'm hoping it's be dating. Jimmy. to be something worthwhile. Oh, that's actually his real name as well, because I was about to say, I can't remember his name. I'm just going to call him Jimmy. Fun. Bunky, thanks so much for the five subs. Meet people who are really interested in the things what I'm interested in. 
I'd like to be the girl Lakers, who's thanks funny for the bits and interesting as well. in the comics and Comrade movies, Grace, and, uh, Queen. certainly someone who's a little bit witty. Thank, uh, maybe thank someone you. who's into my artwork. It'd be fun to meet someone who's maybe creatively inclined, I guess is what I'm trying to say. So you think you're going to find the female version of you? Female version <laughs> of me? At Comic-Con. You know, maybe that's what I'm looking for. Good luck. Wow. <laughs> I like it. Super Steve. Oh, it's I like it. Right? It's good. Yeah. He was it's drawing him as they off, talked. Yeah. He's so quick, what the hell? Every geek's a geek at heart, and you always find something to love about each other. Sometimes it can be a little tough to find people that are into the exact same things, but by and large, it's not too tough to find what the hell? somebody who at least gets it. That joke was creepy. <laughs> okay, Gentlemen, come on, Jimmy. Let's go! Here we go. go ahead I'm following you, man. Wait. My expectations for this. <laughs> Why is he pushing him ahead of him? The dating session. I'm always hoping that I'm going to meet the woman of my dreams. Yes, guys. Come on, come Jimmy. On, filing in. Get comfortable. Jimmy looked like personified what I would expect Jimmy Olsen of 2012 to look like. You know, he's a modern Jimmy Olsen. Everybody really. else is getting modernized. The background characters aren't. Alfred is still a butler. Lois Lane is still a bitch. First of all, thank you all for coming out, okay? Without Cookie you guys, I would actually have to pay to come to this convention. This guy. <laughs> I want to see what they laughed at, but at the same time, I don't want to repeat anything this guy this says. Sci-fi speed dating. Yeah, He's so obnoxious. Rules. One, keep it anonymous, okay? All of you have a number on your chest, go by that. Keep track of the people you liked. If you liked number five, write down number five. A little tidbit about them so you can remember them, okay? <laughs> Ladies, I'm going to ask you to please That's take a seat I'm in any five. of the chairs facing me. Thank you. Gentlemen, please have a seat. In front of any lady you choose, it doesn't matter. You'll have to talk He's to all of them. He's gonna say something awful again. I hope that the girl's interested in Superman. That'll make or break everything. Is he gonna... Everybody, your date starts in three, two, one, and speed date. Hi. Hi. I like uh, your he didn't say oh, anything. Thank you. Are you a Superman fan? I'm more of a Batman really? fan. More of a Batman fan? Oh, jeez. What are you into? Big Superman fan. Do you know who Jimmy Olsen is? No. You don't know who Jimmy Olsen is? Oh, jeez. <laughs> you just strike out if you don't know who I am. Yeah, I feel then I feel just like lost in a void. I don't think you need to rely on the being, you know, recognized for who you are dressing as. Like you could be like, oh, it's like a reporter in Superman. I I think he's a cool character, and then just move on. <laughs> you know? Yeah, nice to meet you. So okay. It's number you know five. Do you know Jimmy Olsen? Oh, okay. <laughs> Do you know who that is? No. You don't know Jimmy oh, Olsen? No. No, I'm sorry. Take a wild guess. He's somebody's pal. No, he don't a... make them guess. Don't put them on the spot. <laughs> Just say it. <laughs> superhero's good friend. He wears a red cape. He's really strong. What? Red <laughs> He's committing too much to this. It's like, you don't know who I'm dressed as? I'm the cop who was in the background of the Die Hard movie at 26 minutes, 14 seconds. How could you not know who I am? It's just a really specific character and he's just committing to the point of like, you must guess who I am. <laughs> I know it's not meant from a bad place, but he needs to just give up on his character. Who the hell is that? What the hell is going on? It's so really, confused. it's a joke. You got, this is all that's gotta be a joke. You don't know who Jimmy Olsen is? <laughs> Oh, yeah, I know, is, I know right? yeah, I know who Superman is. You know Lois Lane? Oh, so the other guy, the one the that no one guy. ever talks about. Oh, no! Oh, Hi, how are you? It's nice to meet you. Me too. Do you know who I am? Do you know Jimmy Olsen? You do? The best photographer ever. That's great. Yeah. Are you Someone into the arts or movies? Uh, or? Oh, yeah. The movies, music, art, What's writing. your favorite movie? Favorite comic book movie? I have to say the original Superman. Yes. Are you saying that just because? No, now he's happy. The greatest line when you know Lois falls out of the helicopter. No screw that. Talk about Jimmy like, Olsen. She goes, "You got me. Who's got you?" Greatest line in movie history. <laughs> greatest line. She was quoting Superman. She was pretty cool. She seemed genuinely Hi. interested. I'm two. Two? Two. Like the number? For you, yes. For me? Yes. Are you joking? Oh, I see what you're. Okay. <laughs> what? What's your number? Oh no, he got really confused. And to be fair, if no one said it like, oh, this is my number, then maybe he just forgot. I think he got really confused there. For Herb and Phibia, thank you for the sub as well. You're very kind. I'm 20, so T. Yeah, I hope you're all right, Phibia. Feel better soon. You're a Hoobian? A what? Are you a Hoobian? I don't know what that is. A Hoobian is. Do you know who Jimmy Olsen is? Wait, a Hoobian, like a Doctor Who fan? 
because when she said Hoovy and I started thinking about those those people in the Grinch, what are they called? You know, they're down in Whoville. So I guess I'm wrong, am I? All right, I'm going to play the video before you all start giving me shit. <laughs> oh, no. One of the ones in, in the Grinch. Okay, Doesn't I'm, matter. Superman's pal. He wears a bow tie as well. Right. Who Superman is, right? Wait, Come I'm on, right? Am I? Am I right? Oh my god, I'm right. <laughs> this is the first time I've ever been right. <laughs> Great. Oh, wow. If they're super hot and they hate Superman, that's something I'm willing to live with. Really, I'm really willing to live with that because you can always train what? a dog new tricks. What you about Jimmy Olsen though? Develop an interest. Well, it was nice meeting you. Have a good one. Everybody quiet, please. Quiet, quiet, quiet. You've all been keeping track of who you liked on your scorecards, right? You're gonna find the papers- Lives on a farm. <laughs> why, why did he write that you down? You will write your first name. Yeah, he's been a bit shallow there, chest, wasn't he? And either your cell phone number or your email address, all right? Oh my goodness. Run, two, three, go. So we get to the end of the session, and Jimmy, he's going through. He's got a lot of girls that are interested in him. Give me that number two. Oh, goodness, man. I'm um, only written my name down on one so far. Uh, there's another one or two that I'm considering, but I'm really torn, so... I think he only wrote yeah, it down on the one he was number two, and he got confused. You know, like, oh, what do you mean you're number two? Figure that out in the next 20 seconds. People, be creative. Number two, really? I'm gonna put a smiley face next to mine to kind of help. I think he's got this. He's just got to make a call. Oh God! The, the, wait, was it number two? How many names did they have? They got a lot of blurring here. That's a lot of names, dude. It's like everyone. Trying to help. I think he's got this. He's just got to make a call. I was a little bit picky. The numbers I wrote down were two and twelve. One was, was really 12. tall and cute. <laughs> And the other one, I think, had red hair and was into Superman. They seem to have more chemistry. Gonna turn out. This is called the perfect match game, okay? What happens if they match with two? Like, if they paper Tinder two people and they both come to sit down, do you just go, oh, there's a shortage of chairs? You can't, you can't sit here. You, you guys do not like him. Well, when did it flip? Was it the shallow comments? Thing is, if he said it, like, oh, if we get along well, then and but they don't have an interest that's fine but he went right for that oh if they're hot but they don't like what i like that's fine <laughs> that's all he said i'm getting the sense that jimmy's a little nervous what this boils down to is you're gonna look at your the sheet, first one that gets to the chair you see somebody that you okay. liked the liked dog thing i don't know that what he said what did match. he say about dogs what i missed that part what did he say um I, d I I don't know what he said. Sorry, <laughs> I have a bit lost here Ladies, on the dog. What did he say about really dogs? Look out in the crowd. Find somebody who are perfect man. Wait, was it? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I need to. Wait, what did he say? <laughs> I don't know. I've completely missed this. Whenever this happened, it, no. That the lowest lane comment was by the other. Dude, wasn't it? I don't know. With. Get to them as fast as you can. He could train. Oh, okay. Run. I get what you're saying now. Okay, I missed that. Quick. Now I get you. I don't think anyone's gonna come over. Are they? Oh wait. Oh no. Oh, they're right in it. Oh no! <laughs> it was literally the chair next to him. So Jimmy might even have been the camera work. The camera work is top notch. The way they're like looking at it from like his profile, and then you're seeing them in the background walking towards. And they sit down, but they're still out of focus. That fucking camera work was like whew, Oscar winning. No perfect Jesus. Matches. How did nobody like Jimmy? What the hell is that? Why are you saying that on a microphone? I had a lot of names. <laughs> I actually don't see either of the two girls that I wrote down on, on my sheet, so... I got a lot of names. I got a lot of names. <laughs> this guy. Jimmy's got a lot working for him, and he knows what he wants. He just wants. shows up every now and again to give him support, and that's it. I wish him luck. 
Oh, cool wait. So fun. even if they don't get to go on the little speed date, the second date, they still have the sheet with all the numbers and emails and stuff. Okay. Beyond Comic-Con, my plans for love, you know, just let that be spontaneous. You know, if something works out and I find something, you know, that's great, but we'll see. Does the cameraman just follow them around regardless if they got a date or not for the entire day? Because he was just sitting there alone and the cameraman's still with him and like it's nighttime now. I've never been in a situation where I've gotten to talk with and interact and flirt with as many girls as I, as I did in the speed dating session. So it was a lot of fun. Uh, I guess I just didn't feel any love connections. But, you know, I would really enjoy to be, to have somebody in my life that I could take out and be romantic with because at my core, I feel like I'm a romantic. I needed something to come Jealous along and just Jimmy. <laughs> electrify me and, you know, knock me on the Jealous ground. Jimmy's me origin like, wow, story. This is, something this is how it happened. It needs to be worked into my life. I need this because if I, if I can't have that, then, you know, then I don't know. The, the ending ones are a bit intimate, aren't they? They just feel so personal. All right, what do we got? Will we do one more? Do, I don't suppose there's Batman, is there? The, the Ansonator? I'm really intrigued in this one. Um, I'm gonna open that, but I want... Uh, is Batman here? Why? Why is there no episode on Batman? They missed the opportunity. You go in order? Should I? I suppose, yeah, we can come back. That can be our prize. All right, we got... We got episode five coming up. They're not that long, so it's good. I don't know what it is, but geeks... Wait, what was episode eight called? <laughs> I'm not sure. She's here at Sci-Fi Speed Dating. Dress as I think I'm addicted. Ow. Will you stop? Oh man, <laughs> I never thought we'd be asking for Ray back. My biggest challenge with dating is finding someone I click with. DC Marvel. I don't know. That's a really hard question. Just say DC. It'll be good. Oh no! Didn't like that. Where is Batman? Like he's gotta be in some episode, right? Ju uh, Juvenilia, thank you for the bits. Uh, Ginger Kimball, thank you for the sub. Julia, thank you for the sub. Danny, thank you for the sub. A tattoo of Turing's nose, thank you for the tip as well. Paul Bello. Uh, McCain, Bosier. Revs, Vibia, thank you very much. Geeks rule! One geek is awesome, but two together can conquer geeks the world. Yeah. What? Yeah. <laughs> Boom. That was intense. Looks really don't look. cinematic here. I think the Comic Con crowd understands that it's what's inside that counts. Look at us. We're just Says him. people. Glasses are sexy. Come on. Exactly. <laughs> hey, yeah. <laughs> Over 18? Yes. Single? Yes. Looking for guys or girls? Guys. Over 18? Yes. Me. Single? Yes. Guys or girls or cats? Awesome guys. Awesome guys. Yeah. <sighs> the host is just. Oh. Oof. I'm Nydia, I'm 28 years old, I'm a geek, and I'm looking for love. I'm a bumblebee! <laughs> I'm a penguin. I've been Mario. Ooh. Oh my god, so many outfits. Yeah, man. Has more I'm outfits than I do. This is Miss Kitty, and she likes to wear costumes too. <laughs> Even the cat is I cosplay. dated this guy for two and a half years, we broke up, and I had trust issues with him. It's been a hard, long breakup for me, and I'm just ready to get in the swing of things and date again. Go on. Yas, queen! Why are you doing this to me? <laughs> the cat's just giving up. I like geeky things. You guys can recognize this guy. This is Toad. Hi. Oh, when's like Dan's him. Toad impression when you need him? Where's Mario? Thank you for the follows totally as well, the folks. That I play video games, Appreciate it. But no love. Go get the other side. I'm trying to. Okay. Have you been on any dates recently? My love life is pretty non-existent. All my friends are engaged. What a game, right though. Right now, or have boyfriends. So I'm the only single one out of the bunch. Yay. Yeah, you know I would like a guy who dressed up. I think that would be awesome because you know I look for any excuse to wear costumes. I'm like, wondering well, if we're dog. gonna get like guest appearances. I'm a gamer. I have the Wii, <laughs> the ultimate gamer console. Um, it's better than Candy Crush, I suppose. 
Um, what was I? What was I gonna say? I can't remember. I was too busy gatekeeping gaming. <laughs> I'll move on. <laughs> I can't remember what I was gonna say. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Honestly, the hot dog would be a great cosplay. Oh yeah, the cameos. Yeah, I want like guest appearances from the other contestants. So like, the I I want Alex to show up in this episode. You know, I really want just Batman in general as well. I want to see Batman. Okay, I have high hopes. When you find someone who's into what you're into, it's a wonderful thing. Geeks rule. I think that the fans you get at New York Comic Con oh, are no. all out, cocked, locked, and ready to rock. This is where the Ultra fans come out. Yeah. The really Ultra Ultra. I can't wait for this to start. You all have a number on your chest. Oh no. That's how you refer to yourself. <laughs> Poor Nidia walked in the wrong way here. Start. <laughs> Got a bit lost, came over here and then went back. There was yourself. a Batman. Please, Batman, come on. A scorecard and a pen. Use this to keep track of the people you liked. If you like number five, you write number five down. My biggest challenge with dating is finding someone I click with. Finding someone who I think would like me just as much as I like him. I hate his new Ray. People who are into the same stuff you are. Nydia, she's here dressed as Chitara, and wow. Save it for begin in three, two, one, go. He ruins everything. <laughs> New Hi, Ray. How are you? I love the costume. Very cool. Oh. Very different. Chun Li, awesome. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> are you really nervous? Oh really no. Nervous? I'm not good at talking. Oh no. I think you guys are intimidated by me because I do have a lot of energy and I guess they can oh, be no. intimidated slash annoyed by me. What, what, are you a At gamer? least he was honest. Yeah. Pretty much. Okay, what system do you have? Uh, all of them? Okay, what's one of your favorite games? I can't tell you because like, I love all games. So PC, console, I love them all. Oh no, it's gonna be hard. Oh bless her though, she was so sweet. <laughs> She's so nice to them. <laughs> what games do you like? All of them. <laughs> are you in costume? Yes. What are you? I'm a Sith Lord. Who? Sith Lord from Star Wars. Okay. A Sith Lord? I've never seen Star Wars. <laughs> no, his soul just left his body. It's like, oh, Satan. <laughs> the reaction. Oh, it's so good. Oh no! Why? What the? F oh, that was just all as hostile. Like, just what are you, Catwoman or some shit? Oh no! What are you, Catwoman or some shit? From no. Do you not know Thundercats? Yeah, I wasn't allowed to. Oh no! Miss Chitara. She seemed to enjoy the session. She was kind of bubbly. Oh, that fun. was rough. That was, oh, that wasn't good. Oh, Jesus. Welshman, thank you for the bits. Sunny boy, Regulus off. Uh, what's up with the Batman thing? There's just, we've seen a Batman in the background and he looks epic and I want to see him in the show, but it, so far, no luck. All over the shop, thank you for the bits. Uh, the Raven, thank you for the sub as well. Uh, Ify, uh, Juvenalia, thank you for the bits. Uh, try not to cringe challenge, but it's all clips from Kermit the host. Man. <laughs> oh no, it's impossible. Fun with it. Oh. Uh, didn't seem to be into that many guys. Is that Thundercats? Yes. Thundercats? Someone got it. Oh. Exactly. Someone got it. cartoons actually bring back memories. Yeah. Jeez, <laughs> I watched Scooby Doo and Tom Eddie. Possible yeah. Spark? I like Scooby Doo, yeah. I'm a sucker for that. Yeah. Yeah. He's feeding you 24. I think I have trouble finding love because I know exactly what I want. Hi, number 12. Thank you. You too. Awesome. What was that? I a Thundercats to tattoo? Attracted to guys with dark features and tattoos and piercings. I'm gonna dress up as him tomorrow. So I dressed up. I'm so excited about that costume. Like a, big a big Goomba. Uh huh. <laughs> I did. You have any um, Thundercats with you or no? No. She should have came to this event as the Goomba. That would have been amazing. You need like two spaces. I think he seemed really sweet and cute. So we'll see. How are you? Hello, number 29. How are you? Nice to meet you. I, I, I did see the way you 
you sat down, you like you grabbed your seat, you sat down like you're like you work each hour or something, you, you throw the what? things across, you're like comfortable here. <laughs> it is an interview, isn't it? So it's like name, rank, serial number, give your resume and you know, I'm confused. You off your feet, right? Thank you, 29. Thank you. I don't think you meant to come across like a bit strange, but he did. <laughs> that was a bit creepy. It was a little bit. I don't think he meant it though. You know, I think it was just awkwardness more than like, you know. I I I think he was just trying to make conversation didn't come out right. <laughs> if you get me. This is all you need right there. Wow, you are a hardcore fan. Is he treating this like a job interview? Yeah, that's what I mean. I think he's just a bit like, you know, <laughs> he was a, a bit awkward more than anything. Stand up, go to that table, touch nothing. Ladies, stand up, go to that table, touch nothing. Hopefully, you've been keeping he's so the people you liked on like touch your nothing. If you forgot to do that, you're screwed. Okay. No. I hope I get a perfect. Match. Someone likes his joke. <laughs> Gentlemen, if you write your name they down, all come like off creepy. Six, seven times, Some have been all right. It's really obvious. Ladies, if you write your name down more than ten times, holy shit, you're tolerant. <laughs> all right, ladies. It's a little fake and laugh. Okay, maybe like maybe she doesn't like his humor. <laughs> okay, if I know a guy's name is Jeff and he costumes as Darth Vader, I know everything I need to know to find him. He's right <laughs> there. What? Okay. I find don't know what that joke him. was. Bad. Hurry up! This is a competition. I think you're it, yeah? Are you? Uh, yes. Oh, wait, she didn't the go guys for him. She was interested in, and the guys are interested in her. She had a few perfect matches. She shows somebody that didn't seem like what she'd be into at all. I'm trying to remember where we left off. Yeah, I talked to so many people. There you go, everyone. You see, different strokes for different folks. <laughs> Anybody else leave a lasting impression? That was a plot twist, to be honest. Depression, maybe? <laughs> what? What did he say? Sarcastic, so we'll check it out. And he has glasses, which so is turn on. So. All right, take a couple minutes, chit chat. Maybe set up a date for something at the con. Okay, <laughs> guys. That was a big plot to his so I'm gonna be honest, I didn't expect that. <laughs> Tell you what, let's we can connect right around the corner off. Yeah, and I have drop your text message. Right? No, I actually just oh. left my email address. It's easier to block through email, not through the phone company. Oh. <laughs> The one thing I've learned out of this is that there's no rhyme or reason how people will be picked. <laughs> I see matches that make no sense. All of a sudden, I don't know. Fireworks. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> That's a bit of an oof. Like. Okay. All right, Polly. Sorry. Yes. Where are we going? All right, so. It was a bit awkward for the first day, but he was really cool about it. I really appreciated that he was such a good sport about it. That is really cool. Is that Asgard? I don't know. I think he was trying to play it cool and be funny. <laughs> I should buy you the sword. It's for sale two booths down. She needs to upgrade from like the broom handle. After a while, it did feel very natural. Talking okay. To if you want to meet up there later or something, I will be playing those free arcade games by the Namco booth later on. Maybe his humor is just really dry. Maybe. I don't know. I mean, we got to remember that we're only seeing like really clipped down um, little clips, I suppose. So maybe like they're having the time of their lives outside of it. It's just, it seems a bit weird from the. The show, you know? They totally have a lot in common as well. So. They do, uh... Yeah, we should get... They have, like, some would classic... Would numbers? Or yes. are you still, like, with the emails? emails? No, 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 no. We could do numbers. There is potential. I see myself hanging out with him. My geek love experience worked out well so far. Uh, I... There was just something... There you go. Awesome. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Text me? Call me? You're totally up for it. I think that's really exciting. Yeah. Uh, uh, what can we know, really? We've only seen a few clips. All right, I'm willing to do one more. Will we do one more? Um, where is it? Episode six. All right, let's watch one more. Oh God, quite, quite, quite the ad. <laughs> All right, I'll just skip this. I don't think we need this. Tactical lettuce, ping pong, red riot, Welshman, Sunny Boy, regular Mary. stuff. Thank you very much. She's got everything working for her. She's beautiful and she's sweet. I can't wear underwear with my costume, so go commando. Oh no, a little Nobody bit too much information there. It's really frustrating trying to find like my perfect Wait, man. No. Oh, did I skip the update? I thought it was over. Sorry, gang, my brain is actually fried. Um, I can go back, right? Hold on. Oh wait, there's just, there was none. I think that's really exciting. Oh, there was just none. Okay.
Th maybe they'll be right in the comments. Why are you Catwoman or or some shit? Thank God for that guy. Makes everyone else look amazing. Maybe that's why he's there. It's just like I'm just doing my part, trying to lower the bar for everyone. You know, no update. She went missing shortly after. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Now we have we're assuming a lot, aren't we? She we'll just make up her own she's ending. Beautiful and she's sweet. Dungeon AI. Can't wear underwear with my costume, so go commando. Your too much information. Your it's really frustrating oh, no. trying to find like my perfect man. Hi. Oh, I'm. What movie is this from? What? It... What? Why can't she wear underwear? I don't know, she didn't explain. Daredevil? Okay. I There's a you. Batman. Don't look for love, it will find you. There's a hot girl out there that wants you. Yeah, there you go. Oh my god, that outfit. He loves. <laughs> Sci-fi speed dating at New York Comic Con. I still got a lot of matchmaking to do. Oh, no. I don't plan on quitting anytime soon. He's, he speaks exactly like Ray. That's the thing. It's like I'm not gonna stop till I get each of these contestants a match. <laughs> they speak the exact happen. same. Over 18, yeah. single. Guys or girls? Yeah. Over 18. Yes. Single. Yeah. Guys or girls? Guys. You like guys. It's just like he has to say something. You know, he can't just go. Okay. <laughs> This is my room. I'm really into movies. I really like Stallone. My name is Mary. I am 24 years old, and I want to meet a guy that's as cool as James Bond, sexy as Stallone, and as funny as Bill Murray. I asked for a Boba <laughs> combination for my birthday, what? and my friend John drew me this picture instead because that's the closest I could get. <laughs> <laughs> What the hell? I've been watching Star Wars with my dad every Saturday <laughs> since I was really little. My high school Wait, choir every teacher Saturday? Let me keep this. It's the sheet. Star Wars every Saturday? Is there enough Star Wars to watch every Saturday? Music from. She Return wants Vin Diesel. Yes. And I know how to speak Ewok now from the sheet music. <laughs> no. This is Electra, who I'm dressing as. This is my Electra okay. costume. I base it off the comic books, not the movie. It's basically a sexy ninja costume. I've got my Psy right here. What are some ninja poses? <laughs> I'm almost completely ready for Comic-Con. Okay. I just still have to get tan. Hey. Tan. Hey, girl. How's it going? Good. How are Do you, you need tan Good. for Comic-Con? Oh, thanks. It's um, tanning lotion. It's really frustrating trying to find like my perfect man because every single one of my friends oh, is in a Oh, that looks so nasty. And I've never been in a serious relationship. Are you looking for somebody who is into comics? Oh, why does fake tan look so gross? Know, just someone cool that likes the same stuff that must I take do. forever i've never actually fallen in love i'm just sick of being single <laughs> i'd like to find someone you're yeah. gonna look like snooky by the time i'm done it with looks you. pretty realistic when it's on the skin by the looks of it there i don't know fanboys fangirls if you're a geek, it's fake tan i know that <laughs> i know it's not real <laughs> if that's what you mean <laughs> it was just such a big blob i thought it was more of a spray people used like, I use fake tan myself, as you can tell from my my complexion, but uh, mine doesn't look like that. It smells worse. Oh, no, I really don't want to smell it then. I'm a little nervous that I won't meet a guy that uh, likes the same movies and comic books that I'm into. Up against the wall. Come on, up against the wall and spread them. Let's go. Uh, who is this? That'd be hard. Yes. Send He's my so minions. fucking weird. Come on, gentlemen, get in here. There's women. I would hurry. This is sci -fi I was going to say who put him on charge, long. but it, this is definitely his own event, isn't it? He organized this in three himself. Minutes, the guys will stand up and move on to the next date. Where's if you Batman? Screw this up, I'll cut parts of you off. Ah. No one even laughed at that one. There's a <laughs> in the background, and that was it. Uh, so now we have Mary, who is um, ultra nerd. She's got everything working for her. She's beautiful and she's sweet. She's got this. Everybody else, sit on down. Three, okay. two, one, go. Three, I think you're. Oh my God! They're jumping in. Tell me. I'm Electra. 
I don't know what that is. Sorry. Okay. Oh my god, he's freaking I'm, out. He's freaking out. Not as big of a nerd as I should be. All right, thinking of something awesome to ask you. Um, were you a pirate or something? <laughs> oh no, he's back. At least he wasn't as hostile this time. <laughs> I can see he's trying. He's trying to come up with an excuse to swear. He's trying to swear here. <laughs> Thank you so much for the follows, everyone. I appreciate that. Thank you. Oh. Um, Daredevil. I didn't see it because it sucked. <laughs> Why are you so hostile? Have you read the comics? No, but the movie was awful, so I didn't read anything else. The last guy seemed kind of douchey. Yeah. Where are you big comic girl? Oh, okay. What? But I like Star Wars. <laughs> what was that? Are you a big comic book girl? Oh. Okay. <laughs> it just killed them inside for some reason. First, I have a lightsaber. I think everyone likes Star Wars. I've never met very many Daredevil fans, but that would be pretty cool. My uh, favorite Come on. comic was Frank Miller's Daredevil. My first <gasps> comic was 180. Uh, the oh no. The time lapse isn't good. I thought this was good because like he immediately said, my favorite comic is Daredevil. And that seems to be a good sign here. If they like the same thing, if that's their favorite thing, it's good record so far on that. But then the time lapse style, it it they're trying to make it seem like he's talking for hours, even though it's three minutes, you know? Like You know, you know what I mean? See? Resurrected, and then the book. Oh, no, no. That was the, the way the creator meant. It. Like this is probably like it was like a minute, but they're making it seem like it's like hours. <laughs> they did this guy dirty. <laughs> oh no. My biggest challenge with dating is I'm really picky. Oh. So this I like is your awesome. Costume. Oh, thank you. But it's for because like I do kids charities and stuff like that. With it. Like first thing I did was go to a, a cancer ward, I gave away some action figures and saw around the shop. Cool. Uh, what else do you do other than cosplay? I like video I games. That like really looks like the Doctor Who dude from earlier. Sorry, the guy from The Grinch from earlier. Is that the same person? Star Wars. I have a lightsaber on my bed. Awesome. I really like that he works with charities. I also used to do a lot of philanthropy work. I still do. So I'm really interested in that. I think it's really great that he There does you that. go. Tell me about yourself. Um, I really like comic books. I like horror movies. I love Suspiria. This tattoo is from the movie Suspiria. Oh, that's the uh, Coven of Witches, right? Yeah. I love Argento. <laughs> I'd be so out of my depth because when they're talking about stuff, I'm just like, <laughs> I don't know what's happening. I'm too boomer for this. Uh, Meg, you? how's it going? I work as a mechanical engineer, mostly into uh, comic books, and, uh, and I also like uh, horror movies that are based in Lovecraft. I don't know too much about him. I just know I like his stuff. Why Electra? Because she's a badass. You know what? I, I shouldn't even ask. <laughs> I shouldn't even ask. There you go. You know who doesn't like ninja? Finally, this is like people who have chemistry, it feels like. Just genuine, like, banter, you know? And Electra's kind of an heiress, man. She parties hard. The last guy seemed cool. The beard is cool. I don't know. He seemed to like me a little bit. Ladies, stand up. Go to Come the on. table. Touch nothing. Then get your <laughs> you can. I like how <laughs> me and all of you in the chat, well, a lot of you in the chat, are like, that's it, they're perfect. <laughs> For like four seconds of talking, we've just decided. <laughs> Hopefully you've been keeping track of the people you liked on your scorecards. You're gonna find the pieces of paper. It's just so the weird like. that example, they have to race to the chairs five, like some bizarre paper, game of musical and on chairs. The paper of the person that you liked, you will write the number on your chest. I oh, this really show is so watchable. Too many guys. Um, there was only one that really stood out to me. All right, ladies, I need you to find the people that you like that liked you back. It's a perfect match. You need to move. So a lot of people don't really understand. Yes. They just take their time. Run. Yes. But the few girls that get it. Meow. Meow. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Danny, nice I to meet you. Oh, they were nice. Yeah, they were nice. Thank you for running. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking of that earlier. I was like, if you really wanted to talk to the person, should you actually, like, make an effort to go faster, or would you seem, like, a bit desperate if you ran? But I, I'm glad he was like, yes, that's cool that you ran. You were so eager to talk to me. I was a bit worried that it might come across as desperate, but I think she did it well. That was Listen, good. Listen, I want a stormtrooper, man. <laughs> Later for the con, or...? I'm going to the 10-year anniversary Firefly event. 
over at the IGN theater. So we want to go talk about uh, yeah. maybe line up for it? Or? Yeah, let's go to line up. They're already leaving. Well, I say that, everyone else in the room is gone. It was just an odd cut, I guess. <laughs> that one guy would say, wow, you ran over here fast. You excited or some shit? <laughs> I can totally picture that. Oh, dear. Motley, Shell, Juvenile, thank you very much. After speeding, the Firefly event was already at capacity. Heartbreak. Ashams, Jekyll, cold thank outside. you for the tip. It's very cold. I feel very bad for suggesting this. On the high line was the place that Danny chose for our date. Oh no. It's too cold. Just go it's in. Nice, it? yeah, nice view. It's too cold. So. Go in. Yeah. Have it's not like he can even give her his jacket because it's feckin' armor. Yeah. <laughs> Would you like my armor? <laughs> I start taking it all off. <laughs> no, what's it about? It's a sci-fi movie with from the 70s with a former playmate. Ah, I'm spilling to <laughs> inevitable betrayal, and the cup has betrayed me. <laughs> <laughs> the conversation was kind of interesting. I think I'm a little much for Danny. If we didn't do speed dating, I think he's just shy. To me um, to me? At Comic Con, I probably would have come up for like a picture, um, but that probably would have been it. <laughs> But Lonely, like, say why? why? Like, Don't cool. just say that because it sounds like you're not interested. <laughs> say why? Say you, you'd you be too nervous or something. Women, it doesn't go well. I feel like overly pressured or that I need to like impress or say something. And she made it okay to just like go with it. Could I ask one thing? Yes. Could I see the hair My if you hair. don't mind? <laughs> What? Because it's an awesome wing, but I want to see the real deal. Oh, okay. Lose the Christina Aguilera wing. I kind of forgot it was Feel a like wing, to be cool. honest. Oh my god, that is awesome. <laughs> that is yeah. so reaction. much better than the wing. <laughs> that is fantastic. The reaction. Most guys give me a lot of shit about having short hair and having it be purple, and how I'd be so much hotter if I had long blonde hair, but I, I totally forgot and she had a wig it, on, to be really honest. Cool and very refreshing. Maybe sometime we can get a drink or something sometime. Yeah, sure. I'd really love to do that. Drink, see a movie or yeah. whatever. Walk the High Line when you're not freezing. Yeah, again. when it's not 12 degrees and I'm wearing a leotard. It, go inside. Went better than I was expecting beforehand. From here, I'm going to hopefully meet him after work one night. We'll get a this drink This seems and talk promising. We'll just see how things go, whether we stay friends or go Do we have an update? This is the important. Oh, happens. we're not going to have right. one. And bring the teal hair. Maybe yeah. that's teal a good hair. thing. I'll, I'll have teal hair, by Do you reckon way. it's a good cool. thing if they don't do an update? Because they're just leaving it at that. Like, what would be the point in doing an update? Like, yeah, we really enjoyed your time. We're going to see each other again, if that's what they just said anyway. That's how I'm going to choose to believe this. <laughs> Will we do one more? I'm kind of addicted to this now. I've gone down the rabbit hole and I can't get away. Hold on, I'm going to just... I'm going to pause it and uh, just run to the bathroom real quick. Um, so I will be right back. They got married. Yes, that's how we will end this. That That is canon. Let me skip this. I'm just going to run to the bathroom. Give me one minute. Thank you so much for the follows as well, folks. I appreciate all 360 yeah, as well as the regulars. Jesus. Sure, sometimes I have to go, but sure, I always come back. Isn't that the main thing? Oh, jeez, there are the 10 people followed. Thank you very much. Stop talking about soup, please, now, everyone. <laughs> Let's jump back in to meet real-life hero, Anthony. Need our sound. Oh, 
Hey, oh. we're gonna find a nice girl for you, Ansonator. <laughs> the Ansonator, he is. I don't, I don't even mind other people doing impressions. It's just the host because he stuffs them in there all the time. Superhero Wash your hands. Type. I did, Jesus. Taekwondo <laughs> beast. I may be a superhero, but I'm so nervous. Geeks know who they are, and they're cool with it. Wait, that guy's super... Oh, wait, yeah, I know him. He was in Stranger Things. I've not seen The Hobbit. I've only seen one of The Lord of the Rings. So, yeah, hate me if you want. <laughs> I, Jesus, <laughs> I'd be killed if I went here. <laughs> it's like blasphemy. It's very hard to find someone that actually understands software humor especially. And then when I talk to them about Lord of the Rings... Yeah, I know. Like, Get angry at me. You have to work space. away. Keep going. Go do something with your perfect match right now. I remember when I actually went to watch The Lord of the Rings and I watched in like four sittings because I don't really watch movies and I guess I watched the director's cut and the fourth sitting I went back to, the movie literally ended within like three minutes and it was like 40 minutes of credits. <laughs> I didn't realize. Speed dating in our world is different than the real world because at Comic-Con, you're in a room with people who are all huge fans of something just like you, so Big there's and Buck, or thank you for the you bits. build from. Pendragon, Blaze Fire, Jedi awkward. Knight, Rickle, it's hard to meet people. Outside, Normal Ferrari, here. Motley, Shelby. Uh, thank you very much for Pretty the much, support. Uh, quote unquote, a freak. But here, you can see the real person, the true person. Geek love. <laughs> Over 18? Yes. Single? Oh my god, yes. his lightsaber's yeah, on. Friends. What the hell are you? <laughs> I am a super EMT, and this is gonna be awesome. Is that is that his own persona then? It's no character. I assume that's his own costume. I'm the Ansonator. <laughs> you gotta I'm put your heart in it. I'm Come on. And I am an awkward geek. <laughs> At least he's up front with it. Identifying patches. On and he sides. is an this EMT. Is the universal sign for emergency medical services. And then below, I actually I assume, have my superpowers. Right? One of my superpowers is CPR. And one of my other superhero powers is Taekwondo, oh. which I used to kick total ass. My superhero <laughs> name is Antinator. It's my nickname, Ant, and Terminator from the Terminator movie. I'll be back. Oh, don't the show it to that Gabe. I'm passionate about are He'll do the impression Park, again. Lord of the Rings, and Mickey Mouse. Oh boy, we're gonna go to Comic-Con and speed dating, and we're gonna have such a good time and find a nice Minnie Mouse. <laughs> it's hard finding a genuine person. <laughs> it's like you didn't that's really try. Passionate about similar things that I am. I'm hoping to find someone. He's got a lot of Mickey Mouse. As well as my fandom, which I can share with them. And then we it's can weird, just be one. Because I've seen a lot of people like really into Disney, but Mickey Mouse specifically, not so much now that I think about it. Yeah, I don't think I've ever seen anyone who's actually really into Mickey Mouse. Big happy family. Squibbity I'm Abby, very thank you. About South Park. Obviously, because I've got each and every one of them on my bed. <laughs> oh no! Oh my <laughs> god, I killed Kenny! You bastard! Oh my god, he even did like a little stop motion thing! A few people Andre, thank thing, you so much for the five subs. It went really, really bad, especially it's when very I found kind. out that I was really into South Park. And then when I talked to them about Lord of the Rings, they were like, what kind of rings? What? So for speed who dating. Like, I, I haven't watched Lord of the Rings, but who doesn't know of Lord of the Rings? Like, who could you say that, oh, have you seen Lord of the Rings? They go, what rings? <laughs> like, I think everyone knows it, right? What kind of girl are you looking for? <laughs> Girls think that it's actually adorable that Sector, I- Sector, thank you mom. for the tip as well. I am a well. for the blondes, but yeah. that doesn't ah, mean okay. that I'm gonna dismiss all the other ones. I mean, I'm open to all suggestions. The thing that I'm looking for at Sci-Fi Speed Dating is to find that damsel in distress that I will be her superhero. And I <laughs> that will angle. sweep right <laughs> off of her feet and then go on an awesome date. The angle of just looking down into the camera. You're geek. Don't be in the corner too long. Once in a while, you got a werewolf out. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> the awkward shots. Ladies, await, and I have oh, not no. drugged them. Good luck. Sci-fi speed dating what the shit is, is wrong with this dude. My, my dating life. This is so not what I'm used to. We need okay. this. Welcome to Sci-Fi Speed Dating. Anthony to, to be the new host. Here. Ladies are going to sit in the chairs facing that wall. 
Everybody excited? Raise your hand if you're really nervous. <laughs> Come on, Anthony. Okay. You got nothing to be nervous about. I Why is Batman not in any of the videos? Like, we see people, like, he got matched up with someone. And we've seen some of these people in the other dating things, but now Batman seems to have disappeared. He was in the first two episodes, now he's gone. Extremely nervous. I may be a superhero, but I'm so nervous. Gentlemen, please have a seat for the girls. Do not start talking yet. Go. The Ansonator. Where is Batman? Asa. He's all costumed up, and the costume represents what he is, which is a superhero EMT Taekwondo I just beast. hope he doesn't get defensive, because remember the guy earlier? When, uh, <laughs> what was it? The, uh, the fella in the suit, you know, and they were like, oh, who are you dressed as? And he's like, I'm not dressed as anything. This is just my outfit. It's kind of the same situation here. Good luck. Awesome. It was a different day. Awesome. Oh, okay. A little less pelvis thrust. <laughs> yes, call him out. Yes. Yes. <laughs> like, can we just stop that, please? Abby, Three, two, thank you so much one. for the 10 subs. Very kind of you. Thank you. As my very kind superior. of you. Thank you very much. Yeah. Oh, you pronounced it correctly. Extra points. Yeah. I'm actually a super EMT. If you're trying to like figure out what, what the costume was, that's what it is. I am oh, an actual no. superhero. I'm a real EMT, which makes it even better. I'm a real EMT. That's what this is for. I actually saved someone's oh, life. Oh, that's I nice. I took the CPR class. How'd you like it? I took it mainly because I wanted to use a defibrillator. <laughs> oh no. I'm a super I EMT. wanted a weapon. Yeah. I was like, if I call 911, then you come out like, I can't <laughs> save you. <'cause> Imagine <laughs> that. He bursts out the ambulance. Honestly, I don't know if I'd feel better or worse. Because he's obviously very passionate about what he does, but at the same time, what if he just like stole an ambulance? <laughs> he's just driven up here. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> My superpowers are CPR and Taekwondo. <laughs> He's getting he a lot of high fives. Awesome. He made his own superhero costume. Well, actually, my grandma helped me a lot. I'm looking for the girl. Hey, honestly, he's coming across way better than I thought he would from the intro. It, it, like, his intro was a lot more awkward than him actually interacting with people. Which, and it's usually the other way around. <laughs> So he's he's kind of making it work. She has the same fan of as me because, well, that'll just make it even more awesome. So, favorite movie? The Matrix. Okay, that's they all have these favorites, ears. But it's not really like up there. My favorite's actually Lord of the Rings. Okay, yeah, that's a bit Gollum. weird. I love Gollum. Do you like Lord of the Rings? <laughs> I do. Who's your favorite character? Um, I like Legolas. Mine is Gollum. Gollum is way better. I'm sorry. Oh no, you, you like see, what? that's the problem. Like, even just the the fact that Matrix is like, it's not one of my favorites. Like, it's like, oh yeah, that's a good movie. I'm a big fan of Lord of the Rings, though. Yeah, you don't need to put a negative spin on the yes. one they pick. Yes, I do like that. <laughs> Who's your favorite character? Um, Please say Gollum. Please say Gollum. <laughs> I don't want to say Gollum. I'm just waiting for the Gollum impression. That's when we'll peak. Hi. Anthony. Who are you? I'm actually my own superhero. Your own superhero? I'm my own superhero. I'm actually real, too. I have a thing for <laughs> blondes. I don't know what it is, but it is my kryptonite. What's your favorite thing so far? Uh, I got to hear Sean Astin, Sam from Lord of the Rings talk. There you oh, go. Yeah, there is extra okay. points. High five. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Getting a I lot of high excited. fives. I love Lord of the Rings. My favorite character is Gollum. Gollum? Oh, I can see that. I can yeah. see that. Pretty damn enjoyable. <laughs> He's saying that to everyone. <laughs> wow, Priest, thank you for the sub. Abby, thank you for the 10 again. Very kind. Griff and Lightning Took, thank you for the bits. <laughs> it was nice meeting you. Oh, yes. Sorry. Oh, my God. Yes, she said Precious from Gollum. My favorite character. Yes, oh, my God. winning that was move. So Cool. <laughs> I like what you had to say. For me, I was like, kind of, oh no, but it, she knows better than I do. She knows her target audience, you know? And I liked the idea behind the costume, <laughs> and yeah, it was enjoyable to talk to him. Okay. Oh, that was Ladies, great. Need you to stand up and go to Have we got a match? Me. Gentlemen, stand up, go to that table and Thank you for the follows, everyone. I'm confident. Very I'm nice, Sam. is an actual blind who is a huge fan of Lord of the Rings like I am. Now, oh, will ladies, it work? I hope you enjoy this part because this is the only time in will your it life work? the guys will take longer than you to finish. <laughs> wait, what did he say? So like, wait, what? Oh, no. 
Dude, it walked his, I'm not even gonna fucking rewind. I don't even know. I just don't want to know. I'm better off not knowing. Number two, she's speed racer. If we got Anthony over here saying that is so wrong, I don't want to know. He is my protector. He will protect me from the host. You get your papers and return to your. I'd rather not know. All right, ladies. Come on, I'm hoping for you. Papers against your scorecards. If you find someone that you liked who liked you back, that's a perfect match. We're gonna do a little competition here to get a three minute date with your perfect match, okay? Another three minute date. <laughs> that look into the camera. <laughs> oh no. Your perfect match right Why now. do they keep Go. looking at. It's Brittany, Speed isn't it? Is the key here. It was the other one he was interested in. Yes, sprints, all of you. It keeps amazing. looking at Brittany. Run, make it look or is it just looking at Three every girls, blonde hurry. woman in the room? 30 seconds to sit in front of a perfect Come match. on, no. 25 seconds. Oh. Oh, no. Gentlemen, if there's I'm sad again. I apologize. It doesn't mean it's over because you wrote your contact info on the pages of the girls you liked, girls you wrote your content to be fair you like <laughs> it's like jump back in i'm like wait i thought it's positive he does have a point maybe like you might not want to sit down with the person because you might have found the situation awkward so maybe she's on the way to email or text him as we speak am i in denial am i an optimist or am i in denial i don't know does that have somebody in front of them please step out now i appreciate it I'm maybe we'll fun. get an update I was hoping Tomato I was King, thank you so much for the five subs. That's very, very kind of you. Concept creator, thank you for the sub as well. Thank you very much, Tomato King. Precious. Denial. One God damn time. it. Even if it was just for that three minutes. Wait, what did he say? I was hoping oh, I man. would get to hear my precious. One more oh. time. Even if it was just for that three minutes. Oh no, he he really wanted that one person. <laughs> The fact that I felt a real spark between certain people and they didn't feel oh, the that's same rough. Way, kind of maybe knocked it down a few notches. Oh, that's so sad. Do we get an update? You know, it's it's got to be frustrating to want to be loved so bad. We all know what it's like when we're alone and we're looking for that special someone. So it's got to be frustrating. The poor guy's got to be feeling it. I definitely feel a little discouraged. Oh, uh, I hope he came time. with someone. It's the same thing when I fight, when I fight super villains, when I can't succeed once, I just keep going again. Wait, is he actually like a vigilante? Because like he was saying, he's a super EMT at the start, but now he's not about fighting super villains. What does he get up to? What? You know, I hope Anthony I hope he doesn't actually go beat on some people and <laughs> dress as villains. With the girls that did like him. I hope he gives him a call. He's got a built-in second chance right there. And maybe he just needs more than three minutes. I know I do. Feck off. Oh my god. This slimy smile and everything. Jesus Christ, he's awful. He is an actual EMT. Yeah, he is, but then I'm worried about the pe <laughs> second smile. It's very uncomfortable. I <laughs> <laughs> I was just like, no, ooh. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, it's just the fact that he was talking about fighting villains is the bit that's kind of like, does he actually go beat up bad guys? Um, Lightning's hook, thank you so much for the tip. Christ almighty, that is very, very kind of you. I have to thank you. You're the first person, or you're the person that is making school bearable. I am so glad I found the Irish lads. Here's my token of appreciation. That is very kind of you. Thank you very much for that. I hope you're enjoying school as much as possible. Um, casual Nanners, Kinder, thank you for the sub. And Tomato King, thank you so much for five subs again. Jesus, that's very kind of you. You're all just too generous. I appreciate it. Do you want to learn oh, do we get an update? I don't want to learn anything. I just want to watch trash television. Yes, update. So I didn't get a perfect match. And no I was capes. a bit disappointed. But afterwards, I noticed I had a few numbers. Yes. And one girl loves South Park as much as I did. Her name okay. is Sarah. And on our first date, we actually yes. spent the entire time going back and forth with South Park quotes. And it was really fun. There you go. It feels amazing to actually meet someone they can share Happy an intellectual ending. connection with. Especially about South Park and Lord of the Rings, which are my two favorite things. Sci-fi speed dating definitely helped me increase my self-esteem. I'm happy. So, I'm, I'm happy. I did it. Are you happy? Because I'm pretty happy right girl. now. Maybe girlfriend? I, I didn't Maybe feel like one. that was going to work. 
I don't, it just ended so depressingly. And you know the way you always hope for like a happy ending and stuff? Like, I think the first episode killed that part of me, <laughs> like forever, <laughs> it is dead. But this time it was like, it, 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 it twisted me again. It's plot twists all over the place. Happy as fuck, yas, yas. <laughs> all right, we're going to do another episode. <laughs> I like how, okay, I'm a little worried. Um what this next one might be because i'm not sure what this implies uh but let's just dive back in because we got none better to be doing <laughs> this is a bit worrying though <laughs> oh I no a sea hitler troll. what i'm surprised that somebody would do something so relatively new and obscure um it's from homestuck it's a web comic Ho homes what is homestruck homestuck it's Homestuck. Okay. Was it? What is Homestuck? Hold on. I'm gonna unboomer myself. Homestuck. Um, it's a web comic. Okay. All right. I'm a little nervous of people not liking me. I don't understand this, the horns. This they isn't good. Like candy corn. Wait. Oh, do, wait. I don't want to learn it. Okay. I I won't bother then. I'll just leave it at the name. <laughs> Don't do it, okay? I'll just be oblivious. <laughs> I'm kind of used to it anyway. <laughs> it's not worth it. <laughs> Jesus Christ, how bad is it when literally the whole chat is like, do not learn about it, do not, no, 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 no. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> okay, I'll stay away, I'll do as you say. <laughs> I trust you, folks. <gasps> Sorry, just... I'll just leave him get it out of his system. I have two favorite things about Comic-Con. First off, I love the costumes. And the fact that I can dress like this, and I can still have a guy that's I know nothing, but I trust Chad Dating also. Normal people Good. when you're an ultra fan sucks. If you're a fangirl, and you want to date a guy that's not into that stuff, it's not more. <laughs> It's like me when I went to lick my wardrobe. <laughs> For newcomers, that's not going to sound good. But you get it. Yes. Horny? Yes. Honestly. Honestly, he could be feckin' Ray's understudy. Just a worse version, you know? Jesus Christ. My name is Kayla, I am 24, and I am a cosplay holic. Oh, I have two okay. closets. Oh no. One is for cosplay. Oh my god. Unless they have over 20 costumes. I date That is a lot. Not very much. The thing oh. I paused it at the wrong time. The thing is, the place looks pretty normal looking around. Like, you got some Disney stuff up here. There's not much about, really. Like, there are things, but if someone, like, it would just walk in that room and not really think much of it. The other people's rooms seem dedicated. Unless I... Then maybe this is her house and maybe the bedroom is all over the place, because... I don't know. Not very much. Disney? Is that not Disney? My boomer's showing. Dating life is kind of dead right now. Your casual <laughs> trident or two. Yeah, that's just the tridents. I can't say much because before, when I used to live in my old house, I used to have a picture. Um, let me swap to here. Uh, Abby, thank you so much for the 10 subs. That is very, very kind of you. Thank you. I mean, like, I've got a picture of Brendan Fraser over here and said do it for him and loads of photoshops of Brendan Fraser. And I used to have a big picture up here with, like, people stuff people made for me um it's in my old house now but there used to be a massive picture it's a compilation of smaller things and like there were so many of jim pickens and i had someone in like fitting my broadband and they were just like so who's the old guy <laughs> just like no it's a long story <laughs> it's kind of hard to explain so i'd rather not <laughs> it's just not worth it i've got so much <laughs> I've got so I saw Brendan Fraser was trending yesterday. I was very happy for him. But I've got so much Jim Pickens stuff, and it's really strange. <laughs> Faye, thank you for the tip there. I will listen to you saying, "Do yourself a favor and ignore Homestuck. It's great, but ruined my life." <laughs> uh, Larry Gox, folks, Tomato King, thank you again. Tactical or not? Light Hope, thank you for the sub. Abby, thank you so much for the ten subs again. Big Bad Burger and Lightning Shook, thank you for the bits. This sad. I, I'm sad you have to go too. We'll come York back Comic next time. Con, but it's not finished yet. It's gonna be the contents from Homestuck. My past an relationships interactive web have been comic. shit. I've had a guy I dated for two and a half years, and 
I had to hide the fact that I liked anime and cosplay, oh, so no. I would always throw them in my closets when he would come around. Oh, and now the comment I actually... made is kind of sad. It's like she's feeling the need to hide her passion and stuff. You're, you're like old guys or some shit. He's the most quotable person. That's sad. I want I want her to be able to express Went to my herself. And found my costumes. And yeah, like come on. <laughs> let let people just be passionate about stuff. Makes me sad. And left my house like two seconds later. So yeah. Oh. Albert, what are you doing? I Wait. am a home health aide, and I live with oh. the couple I take care of, Claire and Albert. Oh my god, she married. does not look happy at all. <laughs> in 58 years, and they're amazing. 58 years. I've never been on a real date. No fooling around on the first date. Is that naked? <laughs> yeah. I think I have trouble finding someone to date because I have low self-esteem. I can't stand it. I feel so long. <laughs> so do I call first or do they call first? Oh no, he has to call you first. So I have to wait? You don't call him. Why? You just don't. This is just a matter of fact. I like her. <laughs> you know, I go to the conventions and I dress up. When people first meet me, I think they might be turned off by the character I'm portraying, Condens of Homestuck. I'll be wearing those Big troll horns are like three feet tall and the fangs and the yellow eyes. It is kind of- I don't think I'd ask you for a date. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> it is kind of odd to be doing a date when you're completely disguising, you know, who you are as a person, you know? Is that odd? Is it not odd? Ray from Take Me Out, thank you for the tip. You're missing my, hey, <laughs> now aren't you? No, no, I'm not. I didn't say that, Ray. <laughs> I really hope to have something that Albert and Claire have of 50 years being married, but it all depends on um, if I find somebody or not. Got it. You must have a lot of patience to actually live with an older couple, even though they seem nice. Well, she seemed nice. There wasn't much talk at Albert. <laughs> but you must have a lot of patience, I would imagine. The advice I would give hey, is to be outrageous. <laughs> Go up to someone and like roar it though. Oh, don't roar at me. I don't know this. All right, ladies. I want you to walk in and stand next to the table at the end Albert of the room. I, I think you look a tired. I'm anxious and happy and wow, I just hope to meet somebody. I'm nervous. Thank you all for doing this. Without you, I'd have to pay to be at this convention. <laughs> so, ladies, I'm going to ask you to please take a seat facing me. Okay. okay. Gentlemen, please. I have think a she'll seat. do well. I think she'll be quite social. Choose, it doesn't matter. You'll have to talk to all of them. I gotta ask, who are you supposed to be? The condens from Homestuck. The condens from Homestuck. Uh, um, it's from Homestuck. It's a webcomic. <laughs> At that point, would you just say, "Oh, I've not heard of it," right? Because <laughs> like he clearly doesn't know it. He's, he's like a sea Hitler. She kills like low blood trolls that are beneath her, like bigger the horns. Okay. Yeah. I don't like oh, him. No. He scared me a little bit. I love <laughs> he scared me a little bit. He was kind of hostile for some reason. Someone that would know my character, maybe? That would be really cool. So, I mean, it'd be nice if someone recognized the character, but like you could get past that easily. Just be like, oh, I've not heard of it. Tell me more. <laughs> like, that's literally all it takes. <laughs> I am a sea Hitler troll. Kayla to be fair, great that's costume, not a great way of I'm leaving I'm surprised it. that somebody would do something so relatively new and obscure for speed dating. All right, so I have to ask, where's your cosplay from? I'm from Homestuck. It's a webcomic. I thought that was our friend was from fantastic. earlier. Thank you. I'm really into Batman comics. Batman? Yeah. Yep. Batman's my favorite. He was cool. He had, like, some things in common with the Batman thing, but <laughs> it's just no one knows who I am, and it's, like, getting annoying. Oh, no. To be fair, okay. though, you did kind of pick something obscure. <laughs> Homestuck. Yes. Homestuck. Homestuck. Brony. You're Brony? What? We're colliding. Uh, what? Colliding forces on the internet. Yeah. Colliding forces? Really... I'm, so, I'm so out of my depth. <laughs> it's like they're in rival gangs or something. I don't, I don't know. Homestuck? Brony, and that's supposed to mean something that I don't understand. I don't understand the whole. And I don't quite understand the whole song. I'm a pony. I got a little tattoo on my butt. <laughs> oh god, no! <laughs> you don't have to 
first share time that. speed dating. I'm a little nervous oh, of no. people not liking me. I just want someone that oh. can actually like sit down. Honestly, a big problem is you're introducing yourself as C Hitler. I think that's a big problem in your approach. Talk. Oh. Yeah. Is Max still no, here? What were your number again? I'm six. Well, basically, anybody I actually I like, I'm just going to write down. I'm not going to worry about it. Okay. You know, anybody I don't like, obviously, I'm not going to write down. Oh, I actually, you there know, you go. You're a good start. Oh, okay. So, Hi. Are you having fun? Yes. Have you seen anybody you like yet? Yes. The one with the blonde wig and he's got the red and white shirt. He's from the same series I'm from. Oh, they're from the same series. What? This guy's face is... Oh my god! I know, right? Who did marry? I know, but you didn't sit in front of me first. Alright, you'll get you'll get the date everybody, I promise. What? I really want like a girly guy and I don't know, he's super cute. Alright, take it off. Hi. Hi. So obviously you like homestuck. You, you like homestuck. I'm so excited. I love your costume. I'm so sad when you didn't sit in front of me. I was like, oh the homestuck doesn't I tried to, but did you really? Yeah, somebody oh. else got I saw somebody going that way, so I was like, oh. Oh, I was so sad. I'm so excited now. Oh, so Dave's your favorite character or Wait, I really love Dad. Dave? What? Is that is that a character also or is this someone we've met already? Because I can't tell if it's a character? He knew like everything. Wait, you know it's a character? That was definitely Am wonderful. I just forgetting it? Express your fandom just so easily. And the character's name is Dave. Thank oh, you. you. Just so shy. You're just so lost. I do feel out of my depth. I must admit. Oh, <laughs> I, Are you I really do. Photo shoot? I'll see what I can do. I'm, I might be too shy. Oh, you should definitely go. Oh my God, you should definitely go. Oh, okay. It was nice meeting you. Right, bye. Well, we're both kind of into the same thing, so it was very exciting. She was also seemed really nice. You've all been keeping track of who you liked on your scorecards, right? No. Seems positive okay, from both sides. No He's like, this really is my fucking crazy. event. I make the fucking jokes. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> I actually wouldn't be surprised if he did. He's very like, this is about me. <laughs> can't be honest with me. What? Okay, cool. You got nothing to be worried about. You're gonna find- What was it? Who's really nervous? Raise your hand and be honest with me. Oh, okay. Okay, cool. There's only you two people. To be worried about. You're gonna find the papers with the numbers on They're it not of the being people honest. you like. And on the papers of the people that you liked, you will write your first name and either your cell phone or your email address, okay? Run, two, three, go. Run. I am going to hope that the people no, you want to say. like me back. Like more so like the homestuck person. I'm hoping they'll pick me. Ladies. This is called the perfect match game, okay? Grab your papers Here real quick, and then come back to the wall. Go fast. How do you find the name? He's all about running. If you see somebody that you liked, who liked you back, that is a perfect match. My guys can put his number. Yeah, mine too. There's no number on mine. Oh. If you put his contact info down, you can call him later. Find the person that what? you're a perfect match with. Get to them as fast as you can. Oh my God. This is so confusing. So what? The, the person she wanted didn't, like, they... I don't understand. <laughs> Did they put their name and not their number? Or they didn't put their number as in they didn't like them back? I don't know. Sit in front of them, yes. I thought I would get picked, but I didn't. Oh, no! It's, it's tough because you see people open up in this speed dating. I was confused. You see their comments levels rise, they're feeling it, and then nobody comes. If you did not find a perfect match, boogie on. I have more sessions. Please come boogie back. I'd on. love to see you all again. Oh, no. For those of you who don't have a perfect match, okay? It means the game's over for you guys. I hope you have fun speed day. Just to see the one person you kind of get your hopes for, you know, put that number down. It's kind of like a throwback. Like, what did I do wrong? Head to the door, guys. If you have somebody in front of you, I oh, know, it's a terrible feeling when you don't get but picked by the to be person fair, like. they didn't go for anyone. Maybe they just they changed their minds. You just got too nervous or something. You don't know. And the people I wrote down, I did, but they didn't write me. Oh, <laughs> it's so heartbreaking yeah, it's when they don't get anyone. I'll be single for a little while. Wait, you saw Jimmy? I didn't see Jimmy. The next day, do we, we get an update? So after speed dating yesterday, there was a huge confusion. The person what? that I actually did like, the Dave crossplayer, actually texted me right away and we ended up seeing each other at the photo shoot that was held in the convention.
attention. It worked! And it was very nice. We clicked right off the bat, and we've been texting ever since. Yeah, do you want to meet me here? See? In the past, the cosplay has definitely scared off people that- Big Kev is right. <laughs> See, it's just a bit of confusion, miscommunication. I, get to know. I thought they the were baguettes for a second. The best part was you get to be yourself and you don't have to worry. I would totally do it again. Fantastic news. Good job, everyone. We did it. We are matchmakers. Hey, everybody. This is my update. Basically, Alan and I, the Dave cosplayer, we've been talking every day, uh, whether it's through Skype, text messaging, and even though there was a big misunderstanding at the session, everything worked out great. There you go! So, he's never been on a date really either, so that makes things even better. New York Comic Con in general was amazing. Ah, uh, isn't that really lovely now? Went, and I just want to give everybody my luck. All right, bye. Ah, they were so nice now. You gotta give it to them, like, you gotta give it to them there now. That's lovely. <laughs> Juice, thank you for the sub. That fencer dude, thank you for the sub. Slow Raccoon, thank you for the tip as well. Oh, good luck with the wisdom teeth removal. You'll be just as wise afterwards, don't you worry now. <laughs> just a little joke there, a bit of a wisdom tooth joke. Uh, Firebird, thank you for the sub. J Fritz, thank you for the bits as well. Very kind. And Ray, thanks again for that tip earlier. All right, how many more episodes do we have? Because I feel like we're making our way through this. Is there 10? Oh, we're already on episode 9. <laughs> Max, why'd you do this to us? Ah! Sorry. <laughs> VM, thank you very much for the sub. The Alpha Ocean, thank you for the sub as well. Firebird, thank you too. Episode 9. Mama's Boy, Ladies Man, Joey. <laughs> That's a weird title. But we're jumping in. Thank you so much for the, the hype train as well, folks. I appreciate it. Whoever he finds, he's got to be able to bring back home to Ma. As far as she's concerned, like, any woman in my life is a threat. What kind oh, of girl are no. you at Comic-Con? We are girls go there. Oh, my God, oh, my God, oh, my God. I just want to find a girl who... That's not mother. good. It doesn't matter if she's a virgin. Oh, this isn't good. And it seems so promising with him, and then she came out and... Oh, she's gonna ruin it. I guarantee you she's gonna be sitting there next to him. <laughs> no, I'm only joking, but imagine the camera pans over and she's just behind him. <laughs> staring. The Rockstar, Tag Rag, Lonnie. Uh, well, At least it's thank you very much. About speed dating is the odds are really good, but the goods are still really kind of odd. Geek Club is the Miss Bug, BM, thank you as well. Weird. The Alpha Ocean, oh. Nightly. <laughs> The Rockster. Yep. Single. Uh, Ashens, thank you so much for the five subs as well. You're very kind. Very. Spiders? As an attraction or as just something to admire or collect or... Whatever you do with your women is not my business. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what? He yeah, was asking about spiders, the weirdo. I don't know. Well, this is It's my just, room, I or... feel like he had, like he has a... a... <sighs> There's no point in even trying to figure him out. It's just he has this need that he has to say something. That's always something awful. Well, I like to refer to as my very geeky man cave. Here we go. I'm Joey, I'm 25. This is my fourth time going to Comic Con. My first time looking for love here. Oh Christ Almighty! Thank you for the support. A sad, a sad Ashikan. Is that it? I'm trying to get it right. I'm really trying. <laughs> Thank you very much for the subs. I'm sorry if I got it wrong again. I'm trying my best. <laughs> Prophylix, silly, and Ashens, thank you as well. Uh, appreciate that. I feel like... <laughs> Kevin, the host is awful. I know, but he's just continuing to disappoint me every time. The Joey seems pretty, like, confident in himself. I'm just worried the mom is going to ruin it. I have uh, right now the Xbox uh, 360, the PS3. I have a Wii. Um, I have a Wii. Oh no. Three words that best describe me. <laughs> oh no. Uh, geeky, ridiculous, and lonely. Oh. If one was to say that I have a relationship with video games, then I definitely cheated on Super oh. Mario with Sonic the Hedgehog. No, why did like, you say it that blue, way? Uh, seductress who <laughs> takes me out into the night and does wonderful things to me. No! I love women. Everything about women. I it sounded so strong. I made. Just stop it! Yeah, oh no! Great. They're so sensitive and wonderful, and they have soft oh. hair. 
Inside skin. <laughs> it's great. I love women. What the hell is that? I have uh, It's Thor's like hammer. an alien trying to fit in just to, the way he said it. Yes, I love women. Soft hair is <laughs> such a weird thing to say. Oh, I never oh. smile on the first date. I'm not that kind of guy. Uh, I think that my trouble lies with finding a girl who matches in terms of both personality, you know, geekdom. Like, I need to find the perfect girl. He's up on his bike. If she exists. My mom <laughs> is a bit... I don't know why it's just like the villain of the piece comes in as he's on his bike. <laughs> Bro, silly, third scenario, art, Laura, Brian, thank you very much Torn for the subs. Would you want me to find like a nice girl to bring home? I, I don't think that's the place to find a nice girl. On one hand, uh, she wants me to be happy. She wants me to find love. What kind of girl are you going to find a comic What is it with controlling kind of girl? moms? Weird girls go there. On the other hand, my mom likes me where I am right now, living at home with her. So, uh, as far as she's concerned, like, you know, any woman in my life is a threat. Oh, no. What exactly do you think these girls are doing? Do you know that instead of doing drugs and drinking, they're reading comic books? <laughs> it's like, I know. <laughs> I just wanted someone who can give me a hookup for the old heroine, you know? I don't want nerds. I want bad people. <laughs> Jeez, on Mario and Sonic, thank you for the tip. The introduction to psychology Shut up, Kevin. Who knows what they're doing between pages, okay? <laughs> what kind of thing is that to say? Who knows what they're doing between <laughs> between pages? <laughs> Sudashi. Okay, I'll try, I'll try. Sudashi, thank you for the bits. I'll try it. Sado. Sado. Okay. I'll get there. I'm really bad at pronouncing things in case you haven't gotten it. Between Joe, pages? Joe, like, oh, Joe. let me turn a page and let me smoke a little bit of something. No, yeah. And then day they are playing and they are learning. No, no, no. And You're good wrong, wife. Sorry. And yeah. all they play together. So nice. <laughs> <laughs> he, he's still got much more positive attitude. I like that. Then they play together. It's so nice. <laughs> I just want to find a girl who will give me hugs and kisses and isn't my mother. I love you, Joey. I love you. Too. I want the best for you. Always. The dad seems sweet. And maybe the mom's nice and is misguided, but it doesn't seem good, like the vibes given off. Alpha male, Charlo, Darkies, thank you very much. Bullshit, thanks for the bits. No, all the people I've dated have been geeks. You just have an understanding of the fantasy. I've world watched it, Bullshit. Don't. The fantasy is what makes it real. Deep love. The success rate we're having with sci-fi is pretty son? good. Are you winning, son? No. <laughs> one married couple, ten engagements, and up to fifty couples dating seriously. Jesus. Come on in, guys. Nexus, thanks uh, for the sub. Anxious, Moving Fortress, thanks for the five. Exactly Again, you're find. very kind. Hopefully, I will exit not being alone. Gentlemen, treat the ladies with respect. Ladies, this do is not a new use day. This is a perfection on your friend zone technique. Okay? <laughs> Don't practice that shit here. So we've got Joey. He hasn't had a lot of dating success. He has trouble finding girls if he can't bring back Moving home forward, to Thank you so much for that. The days are three minutes long. Every three minutes, guys, you're gonna Ew, follow the girls what's on the floor. What now? <laughs> I keep zoning out. My expectations today, uh, I'm trying to set them as low as possible because basically I do not want to set myself up for failure. Every oh, Thursday, no. have fun in sci-fi speed dating, so enjoy yourselves. Unless you're fling on leave. These are all <laughs> new people. All right. it's, a, it's an entirely new day. Speed dating begins in a couple seconds. Three, two, one, go. Sit in front of any guy you like. Oh my god, some of them look so pissed oh, off before it even started. I'm the nefarious number 22. Oh, that's my favorite number. This is perfect. Uh, no, you're just saying things. Did you play sports number in school? Did you play any sports in high school? No, I was the most unathletic person in the world. Really? Yeah. <laughs> He's uh, just straight in there. Asthma, or at least my mom believed that I had asthma as a kid. So she basically like was like, don't go out. It's scary out there. Why are you a comic? Oh man, his mom has just sheltered him, isn't it? Isn't that the case? That's what it seems like. What a weird thing to say. <laughs> it was a bit odd. <laughs> Andy, thanks for the bits. Why? Why wouldn't I be at Comic Con? I mean, like, what are you here for? Games, comics, movies, everything. Everything. I don't know what it is, but like something inside my brain is just like. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right. <laughs> I like that. It's gonna be my new message something alert. Inside my brain is just like. Here, here it comes, here it comes. Oh, no, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I like that. So you're a big uh, video game fan? Yes. Is this a good stress reliever when I'm like ready to kill somebody? Just nope, gonna shoot zombies all day. We had a lot of the same interests, but he was also like interested in everything, kind of like I am. He was really sweet. 
So many of them have these ears. So many of them have this. <laughs> She's like, I don't know, are they? Um, yeah, Nico Mimi. You know the brainwave ears? I, that's a thing? Yeah, I, I don't know this reference, the, the ear thing, whatever it is. Christ. They're probably sold there. Yeah, I always noticed that when I was going to like some of the conventions. I did like meet and greets and stuff at some of them, which by the way are awesome. They're actually so good. Even though I'm not a huge fan of the events themselves, usually it's just me going around confused as usual. <laughs> that's just a normal day in the life for me. But there's always like one item that's super popular because it'll be like something popular and something relatively cheap and like half the people there have it. I see that you also have ears. Do you like think like certain thoughts and like they just start moving? I don't or? know, maybe it's just because I am just really nervous. <laughs> oh, that's oh, intense. It's really hard to tell who would bring home to mom. Uh, <laughs> he's not even thinking about himself. He's just thinking about who would my mom like? <laughs> I'm costume right now. I feel like you generally know what you're going to get into even before the conversation begins. It's kind of weird how that works. I have a great polar bear joke that ends with an icebreaker. Okay, go for it. Oh, no. That's it. It's right there. <laughs> oh, no. Risky joke. Risky joke. <laughs> the jaw. Oh, no. All right. Oh, I... uh, gotcha. She got uh, it. All right. Exactly. Saved. Phew. So, I think. Doctor Who? Oh, my God. Yeah, it was I'm trouble with the background noise here. On the street, like, oh, there goes that professor with her bow tie. <laughs> Where is she going? It's Saturday. I thought he was adorable. He was sweet. And, um, I, I miss like, most of that. Comic Con is like a time warp. It is. Time warp. Wibbly wobbly, tiny warp. <laughs> the Doctor They're Who talking some about Doctor Who. I don't know. Very warm and uh, very kind and very beautiful blue eyes. So, are you supposed to be the Aunt Jemima Captain America? <laughs> Sorry, I just see the apron. You're supposed to be, uh, oh, the burger show. Yes! Yes! You're the first person! Am I really? Really? The fr the, the Bob's Burger thing, right? And that's right. I, I thought most people would know what this is. Do I know something other people don't for once? The the Bob's Burgers, uh, not Tina. Um, hold on, don't tell me, don't tell me. Louise? Is it? Louise, yes, I did something right for once. Jesus, thank God. Mike and Laura, thank you so much for the tip. A terrible, thank you for the tip as well. You're very kind. Hannah, crazy lady. Uh, hey, hey, Chino, Andy, thank you very much. God, someone just like decided to just like bust that out. She's, you know, kind of seemed, you know, cute. <laughs> <laughs> uh, everything. Star Wars, comic books, uh, you know, sci-fi movies, uh, video games. Uh, kind of stuff. How about you? It's too I play D&D a lot with my friends. The thing is, you can like everything, but you can only love some things. You gotta be a bit more specific to start the conversation, you know? <laughs> you said D&D, right? Yeah. I've always wanted to play D&D. Are you ever the Dungeon Master? Actually, no, because it's too, it's too hard. <laughs> quiet, quiet, silencio. Shut your pie holes. Gentlemen, you're gonna stand up, you're gonna go to this table. Ladies, you're projecting. you're gonna go to that table. Go, run. Now, I've been keeping score on your scorecards, okay? You're Who's gonna he gonna go for? Of paper on the table that correspond to the people you like. There was one that. All right, go. Kind of got along well there, wasn't there? It's actually all the giant blur right now. Thank God that they let you make notes because, like, yeah. it's just a lot to take. To be in. fair, it is. It's like 30 people. Joey nails it. In an hour and a half. Every girl writes their number on his paper. B came out swinging. He was given roses. It looks like he's pretty solid to get a perfect match. Gentlemen, when you are done, you will have a seat. Okay, ladies. At this point in time, you're gonna head over there and grab the pieces of paper that have your number on it. Quick run. Please ensure that you have the correct don't, piece don't of paper. Don't run. Stop Damn. telling people to run. I'm actually, about five. Uh, it's uh, that's kind of crazy. I'm feeling pretty great. All right, ladies. I kind of need you to spread out in front here. Now this is a competition. You need to be fast. That's the Stop key. Stop telling okay? them to run. Like someone's I mean, gonna Dr. get injured here. Yeah. Absolutely amazing and uh, very beautiful girl. Uh, now I'm actually starting to get a little bit nervous. Find your perfect match. It's the Doctor Who. So yeah. Joey got his eye on Doctor Who, and there's a good chance she likes him. The problem is every girl wants him. Whoever gets the first win. <laughs> He's like, I did not expect this result. <laughs> Everyone just charges for his seat. <laughs> Go, find your perfect match. Oh my god, she's off! Oh no! <laughs> it, like, mm, you see what I mean? This, oh, 
all right, okay, no, this is fine. Let's, they still have each other's number. If he's, maybe. Yeah, I, I run a lot. Quick, 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 quick. So. So you come here often? <laughs> Actually, yeah. It's so only my second time, but yeah. Um, I will say that I had oh, uh, someone it's, else in mind. It's just doctor. such a weird format because the person sitting has no choice in it. Like, I know they added the... To be fair, he did add her to the list. If he really only wanted her, why not just put down her name? You know? That's a bit odd when you think about it that way. Like, he seemed disappointed that she sat down. Maybe he wasn't disappointed. Maybe it was just awkward, but... Just put down one. If you're like, I only want this one. You know? Who girl, actually. Uh, Bit odd. I also like this girl, too. Okay. Maybe the Doctor Who girl was just the one who's got the best first impression. Like, a huh. perfect date for me would just be cooking and then sitting around, like, kicking each other's butts in Mario Kart, so... I thought you were just gonna end I it there. <laughs> I just wanna kick, kick each other's butts, that's it. Missed the entire uh, cooking part, maybe because I'm like, God, I'm just, like, just kicking yeah. butts in Mario Kart. That works that's too. I like cooking. I don't, I don't get a feminist thing out of it. It's not like, oh my god, I won't cook for you. It's like, I like cooking, so uh, I'll do it. Right. She loves to cook, so... Yeah, that's definitely the two qualities that I think I'm looking for. Uh, a girl who plays video games and a girl who's domesticated, so I can bring her home to mom. Uh, well, I mean, if you're into video games and everything like that, I mean, like, I've got <laughs> lots of video games back at my place and a comfortable couch. Uh, so uh, how about this weekend? Oh, okay, no. playing video games. I don't know, it may seem awkward as a first date, but I'm actually going to have her meet mom and come back to my place. I feel like we should have seen this coming. I don't know. There were so many red flags. <laughs> That we, I think we just kind of ignored, like they were coming up and going, oh no, and he'd say something and we just kind of went on anyway and then forgot about them. Well, I'm disappointed. Place. <laughs> oh, so oh, he wants a second mother. <laughs> May, no wonder his mom is threatened. <laughs> oh. Hey, how are you? How are you? Good to hear? Eh, tired, but it's coming on! Hey. So. Okay. I'm not sure if this will be my most awkward first oh, date, no. but all signs say that yes, yes, it will. Hi, hi. No way hi. did he take her to meet his parents on the first date. Oh, Jesus Christ, gang. It's about to get wild. <laughs> get your cringe protection on. <laughs> You too, I'm Emily. Oh, there's so much time left. Like, usually the recaps are like a minute. Oh, no, 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 no. Hi. No. Uh, yeah, meeting the parents on a first date was a little bit weird. But That is extremely you know, weird. We'll see. Beautiful. So you like to play <laughs> video games? I am a game. You see the drippy on titty dog. Hop in my car in a giddy up. We are in danger. <laughs> oh no. Gamer, yes. Oh wow. I have some food here for you. Just a bottle of water. Oh my god, a banquet. Bottle of water, okay. Yeah, the Spider-Man paper plates. So, Emily, are you originally from New York? Or? Uh, no, I'm not. I'm from Delaware. I'm just up here for college. Oh, where do you go? Uh, I go to Columbia. Oh, great. Hi, Lee. This is so freaking weird. This is so weird. Like, first date, meeting his parents, being asked about, like, college. It's like, oh, great, Ivy League. Meanwhile, the paper Spider-Man plates are on the table. Wow. Oh. And the cameraman just and... standing there, like, <laughs> just just to add to it all. Play <laughs> some video games, yeah. Okay. Let's just go. We can take turns on the bike because there's not enough room for both. I might buy a tandem exercise know. bike if you want to stick around. Uh -huh. Yes, you put the bike aside. Good. Oh, you have the most sensual screech of a heartbeat. I hate it when you get the long ones. You don't know where to put it. Right? This would probably be a very easy way to get friend zoned to play video games on a first date. I don't think that was <laughs> the problem. Video games are actually a great way to loosen up. <laughs> I am hoping and I think it's going to turn into something a little bit more romantic, okay. but, you know, we'll see. It's only the first date. Honestly, it's got to go up from here, right? After that? What was that scream? Honestly, it kind of reminded me of my panic scream when I just go, ah! <laughs> something <laughs> jumps out at me. Andre, thank you so much for the five subs. That's very, very kind of you. Victor, Verber, and Chuby, thank you very much for the subs as well. I want to apologize in oh. advance for what's about to happen. Oh, shoot. 
what? Yep. How did that even? Yep. What? Really? One second. And that's you, all that matters. You're playing <laughs> dirty? Yay! <laughs> Okay, you don't want an empanada off the road? I'm good, but thank you. They look delicious. Are oh, you leaving already? Yeah, I have midterms oh, to study quick. for. I'm oh. so sorry. Yes. It's great to meet you. Thank you. Same Anytime here. Bye-bye. Okay, <laughs> I don't Sounds have good. to be here. <laughs> <laughs> I just, the dad's kind of adorable in a weird way. He's just, it seems like he's trying to relate, but he just doesn't get it. Like, it's like he, he's trying to be friendly, but it came across as more of a killer kind of thing, you know? It's like, anytime you want, you can come play. <laughs> it's like they're a bit too old to be saying it that way. Wow. <laughs> oh. Take care. Bye. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> in a way, it's just Very goodbye. <laughs> Forget the old culture. Whatever you think, this is United America, free country. Okay, I, I, don't, I don't know exactly coming. what that means. <laughs> what did he say? Whatever it means, it doesn't matter if she's a virgin. What? I'm okay. Maybe, maybe he's not okay. I love I'm so fucking and seeing confused. The people connect. Just because they weren't fast oh, enough. Oh, look at Whiplash from like all the, the takes. <laughs> oh, I don't know what's going on. I'm just going to keep playing. Match. Doesn't mean anything. So Joey's playing the game here. What? After the date with the perfect match. Hi. Uh... He finds the Doctor Who girls. What? Interested and sets up another date. You picked me. I picked you. you know? I just, I didn't like get over to your class now. Yeah. yeah. No, I mean, if you're interested, like, we can... He's just going can, right can, up. ...drink coffee or do yeah, something. Why not? Definitely, definitely. I'd love it. Okay. <laughs> I just get this nasty feeling that when he says, let's go drink coffee, he means bring her back home and get out the paper Spider-Man cups. And I'm a little bit worried. Yeah. So I actually have a second date to come out of Comic-Con speed dating. I'm Ari, by the way. I'm Joey. Wait, did so anyone get really each other's names? I'm not sure uh, what to expect, probably because they really had a date at Comic-Con. Uh, it's but, so I mean, bizarre that like he just went up to talk to her, but also he found the cameraman beforehand to go up and talk to her. Like, I don't know. Does, is the camera just following around the whole time or what? It's more romantic than the Javits Center. Honestly, I take a whole like half an hour episode on this episode alone. I want them to go back to the parents again <laughs> to, to me, but it's probably best for her sake that they don't. Oh, they both went to the same no, stool. The KFC guy that was like one of the Avengers. <laughs> I was too busy watching Spider-Man. Honestly, that is my hero, <laughs> Colonel Sanders in Avenger. Laura, thank you very much for the tip. You're very kind. Snuck onto my husband's account to give you more money. I hope he's aware of this. <laughs> Jesus. Hey, Gino, thank you for the bits. Juggernaut and Brandon, thank you very much for the tips as well. Uh, Darsh and Earth to Maggie, thank you for the tip as well. Thank you for the Ballet, kind of words, that. Maggie. <laughs> One of us is talking, the other one's like, Oh my god, this is the most amazing thing ever. <laughs> we definitely what? had a good time. She's still really into Doctor Who and whatnot. Like, I think she told me that she bought a plushie today that talks. Uh, I think there's definitely a very good chance that I will see her again. Okay, how many people can say that? My first, like, one of my first dates, I went out with like Peter Parker. Right? How cool is that? What? You, uh, you don't have the face, I, mask? No, I do. You uh, have to put it on. You can't make me put this on. Wait, is he no. gonna put on the Spider Man mask? Because you've got a great smile. I'm gonna try putting it on. Cause they're kind of cute like that. Oh, thank you. I'm excited to get to know That's him. That's so bizarre. Uh, he's really nice, interesting, super She smart. seems nice. She does seem uh, nice, to be fair. He's cute. I figure maybe we'll go find crime and I'll put on my mask and you can watch me yeah. fight while you sit there and look pretty. I really can't say right now uh, who I would choose between oh the two girls. But you know, cake love is great. It's the best thing to happen to my love life. <laughs> I'm a lucky girl. I do it all. <laughs> oh, 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 no. There's another update. Hey, it's me, Joey. And what speeding at Comic Con taught he's me is that. He's on his bike. He loves his bike. You know, it's very hard to have. Do you think he's co his console is powered by the bike? And that's why he used to keep cycling? Girls over the house uh, to introduce them to my mom or to hang out here at my house. Uh, if my mom's going to basically be questioning whether or not they're virgins or what their motives are with me or anything like that. And so, basically, what this entire experience taught me is that it's time to move out. And so, I'm basically in the process of uh, moving out into my own apartment. So, that's exciting. I cannot uh, believe that, honestly. I'll be able to, you know, bring a girl over and 
play Tetris and not have to worry about my mom coming in and serving us tanning Is that the snacks. Like a cake? <laughs> Laura again, love, thank you for the tip. Jeez, don't be, please don't get in trouble. I don't even understand what you mean exactly, but please don't be donating someone else's money if that's what's going on. I'm confused. Thank you for the tip. I just hope, I hope this is a joke or something. I don't want you actually uh, donating money that isn't yours if that's what we're getting at here. Uh, Boshi, thank you very much for the, the bits there as well. Jesty, thank you as well. That was a feckin' roller coaster. I don't even understand. I think we've won episode. Wait, Geek Love bonus episode? Wait. Hold on. Is this... Let's just see here. I think... It's a bonus episode about Joey. Kick off some what the hell is this? Alright, let's explore. I'm so confused. I'm Emily, I am 19 year old student. This is my second year at Comic-Con and my first year speed dating. Was that the first one you went on a date with? It is was. This costume okay. that I will be wearing to speed dating. This is Final Fantasy VI. Uh, this is Realm Arony. I am incredibly passionate about cosplay. It's pretty much the number one thing in my life uh, that isn't school, work, friends. I'm confused where this is going. I'm making usually between five to ten new costumes a year. I'm pretty much constantly working on it. Like something. we're already like a third I'm done. Very good to accuracy. Um, I'm confused. Everything is handmade. Dress is satin. It is pleated as accurate. A lot of times people... I guess they just picked out a handful of people to do the videos with and she happened to pick someone who was also getting recorded and then they couldn't make a full episode with out of it? The draping dresses. I had to pleat mine. What I have been told is both my best and my worst quality is the fact that I get very single-minded about things. This is my pride and joy of the entire costume. I'm um, confused. This wig probably took me 12 to 15 hours all told. I took an Arda wig, which is Why already Why is the music so intense? Is there boss music the playing? Extensions, hand tied each and every single blonde piece into the weft or the wig itself, and then sewed in all the extra wefts. I love it and it's gorgeous. And I'm it's worried. what I care about. <laughs> She's the boss. In terms of Maybe it's Joey's date, mom. Confidence is probably one of the biggest turn-ons for me. I would like somebody with a very strong personality, someone who I'm not gonna like steamroll over or I'm gonna have to always worry about possibly offending them. I am always me, and if somebody doesn't like that, then that's fine, but I will not change who I am to, to hopefully make a better impression. <laughs> I don't know, that, that intense look. My experience okay. with sci-fi speeding was really great. Like, there Sorry, were some guys who the minute I saw them, um, I was like, okay, you're, you're too quiet for me. Like, you're not gonna be able to keep up with me. But when I saw my first choice had put his name down on my paper, it was kind of like the, the heart, like, sh the shock. I kind of oh, got really lightheaded no. for a second. I was like, oh my god! Okay. Okay. I'm very happy that I did uh, meet somebody who I really liked. Oh, uh, see, now I the run is very different when you're getting our side of the story. <sighs> that at least get a good date out of it and i would really like to see if we think it can go any further after that it's kind of like powerpuff girls but on oh. track it's super sexually charged you got me with powerpuff girls yeah i would definitely tell people about speed dating it was a lot of fun i met some great people and i met a date i don't to be so jealous <laughs> of us uh, we just watched an entire season of geek love <laughs> That was so sad though. It kind of makes it even worse that we didn't get a resolve. They just went off happy, but we know it doesn't end happy. That's sad. <laughs> That's not the good ending. It's not. We didn't even get to see the boss fight. We heard the boss music, but that was it. <laughs> we can't end like this. One more. There is no more. It's gone. We're out. We've got an addiction, but there's no more supply. <laughs> There might be more other stuff. Sci-fi speed dating fan X 2015. What is this? Oh no. <laughs> I think this is just like a... Okay, this is just like a weird interview or something the whole time. Colin interviews Jedi Master Ryan Glitch. Oh, wait. Is this the same Ryan from before? It looks like a different person, but I'm guessing it's the same person. 
Uh, we don't really want an interview with him. We've had enough. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think we need another one. <laughs> I'm crying. It's too sweet. And she was very sweet. I feel really bad now. God damn it. Rob goes sci-fi speed dating with TLC's geek love? What? What is... Geek love? Is that... Is it an actual show? I don't understand. What's it? Geek love? Geek... It's a novel. No. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> geek love... TLC, if I search that? It's a TV series? Oh, but there's... Wait, there's two seasons. Hold on. Hold on here a second now. Oh, wait. I think we did... I, we just watched season two. <laughs> that that last one was actually called Mama's Boy, Ladies, Man. Um, okay, so... There was two other episodes. Let your geek flag fly. What if I search for that? Oh, wait. This is like a, an actual 30-minute thing. Wait, that's... Okay, so it was actually a TLC thing, like an actual TV show. Alright, well, I don't think I'm going to be able to get it on... I guess this is the part one of it. That is it! Okay, so it was a TV show first, and it had... Well, it had... When I say a season, it's season one, two episodes, so I'm guessing it didn't do that well, and then they tried to adapt it into a, a like, web series. I'm guessing. Um, let's see. Emily... Wait. Emily commented on the last episode? Hold up, hold up, hold up. Where was it? I've lost it now. Bonus episode. Uh, hi guys, Emily here. This is probably going to get buried, but I would like to say that I really don't care that Joey went out with someone else because we stopped talking basically the day after the date and I completely lost interest. <laughs> I have gone a few dates since as well. No heartbreak here. That's what we like to hear. Yas Queen. <laughs> ah, well, it worked out in the end then. Not that sad. All right, I guess. Will we move on? Will we play a game of something? I do play video games too, I swear. I don't just sit around looking at um, <laughs> dating shows, although that is starting to feel like that's the case. <laughs> All right, what's the plan? What do we play? We could play some some GeoGuessr, that might be fun. I wouldn't mind playing some GeoGuessr, we've not played in a while, and I do have a premium account, so we could jump in on that. Um, <laughs> Laura, thank you again for the tip. Bosha, Billy, how to end Mega Shank, a guy from somewhere. Uh, the boss is the hostile guy. What are you, a ninja or some shit? <laughs> he just walks into the room to that. <laughs> April Bug, thank you for the bits. I like to thank you for the bits as well. <laughs> April Bug, thank you for the bits. And Zay, thank you for the bits again. All right, let's let's jump on some GeoGuessr, I suppose. Oh, GeoGuessr. I have a premium account, by the way, on GeoGuessr. I'm not sure if I've mentioned it before. Um, I'm extremely good at it. What what will we do? Will we pick? Will we pick World again? This is always difficult. Um. Uh. Um. Okay. There we go. And let's... Yeah, let, let's just leave it on that. Fine. Uh, Germany? You think Germany already? I'm starting to think Germany too. Is this cut off? No, it's not. All right. Robin, thank you for the tip as well. <laughs> Feels like watching a, a TV with a bunch of friends. Yeah, and I don't watch much TV, so it's a good excuse for me to actually watch some. And God, it's great. <laughs> it's Lila Lucas and Joshy. Thank you as well. All right. Let's jump in. We're going to try and pinpoint here. Oh, for feck's sake. You know what? Maybe this isn't too bad. Anyone got any ideas so far? Um, I'm thinking Eastern Europe already, but I'm hoping we can find a sign or something. It, it's looking like Eastern Europe to me. What do you think? Oh. Okay. Read the signs. Eastern Germany. We're all right. Are you? Is that just because we always say Germany? Or is this actually German? I think this could actually be German. It is Germany? Okay. <laughs> it's Danish? To be fair, just because it's... Uh, cause it could be, like... DK at the end of that Donkey Kong doesn't mean it's actually Donkey Kong country. It could just be traveling. Denmark? 
Pretty sure it's California. North Germany. It's not German. Is it Danish then or what? Denmark. Okay, let's let's take a look around and see what we can find. Um oh, oh bosses are always good. Um all right, that doesn't help me because like, oh Jesus, hold on, sorry, didn't mean to just cut you off there. Let me go across the road again. Uh, this is gonna, this is gonna hurt my brain. Someone's gonna have to help me here. <laughs> Wait, maybe it is Donkey Kong. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Sweden, Denmark. It is Denmark, but we need to, we need to find like a road sign, don't we, to make it a bit more specific. I'm thinking more this way this looks like it has more life it might have like a sign going into the town or something okay this looks promising uh why is there no signs oh oh sign hold on okay what go back what does this mean no dk's donkey kong <laughs> wait we're gonna need some music it's too quiet now i need the boss music <laughs> Type, thank you for the sub, and CCC, thank you very much for the, uh, for the tip. You made a map? I will take a look at that next. Next game, we'll do that. Uh, where's my thing? There we go. Alright. Um, Lokitz and Robin, thank you again. <laughs> Definitely, Kevin. Okay, so there's a hospital, right? Is this... Is this street or something? Or parking, maybe? Because it has, like, the letters? That is Denmark. But where in... Where in Denmark? We need to start narrowing it down a bit. Entrance. Okay. It's entrance. That's not going to help then. Oh, wait. There was, some, there was another sign down here. Um... Carol? <laughs> just this professor. Is this helping at all? <laughs> Denmark, Germany. <laughs> All right. Where in Denmark could we be? <sighs> I'm not going to find anything here, am I? Unless it says something in the hospital, like hospital of, you know, Kark or wherever it might be, do you think? Uh, <laughs> why is your language so confusing? <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm leaving the hospital. I'm trying to find somewhere else. Hmm. This isn't helping either. I've gone down some cycle track that I don't think this car should be on. Turn down the music a bit? Yeah, sure. There we go. That's a bit better. Hospital of Germany. Go to start. Yeah, I think we need to return to start and go another way. Maybe there's a sign here. <gasps> it's our house. Is that... that That's like the city name, right? Or town name or whatever, surely? It's got to be big enough, right? Because it has that big hospital. Our house in the middle of the street. Our house. We just got to look in the middle of the street. Um, <laughs> it's right there. You're going to have to be more specific than that, I'm afraid. I can't see where you're pointing. <laughs> Gang, no, that's not going to work. You're going to have to be more specific. <laughs> All right, we got to find a hospital. There's one there. That's a pretty big one. Um, and it did look pretty big, to be fair. Turn to start. Um, which way was the hospital? I went up this way and turned... No, I didn't turn down, did I? Oh, God, that's confusing. Let me just burst through these road signs. I'm sure I went that way earlier and there was no road signs, but anyway, sure, what harm? Uh, okay. It's right there. Yeah, we, yeah, we got it. We got the hospital, but we got to look. We got to try and figure out where we are. I keep forgetting this is a stream, not a video. <laughs> You're not used to watching me in the wild. Will we just... Wait, it's not there? There's... A... It's on the coast? I was wrong. Wait, what? Is there another hospital? Really? But it looks like such a big hospital. Why would they need two? Hmm. There's got to be signs for the, the hospital somewhere. I swear I went up this way. Yeah, I did. And then I went down that way. Okay. Hmm. 
one for emergencies that's a university hospital you're correct there's only one hospital Turn she, I am putting my complete trust in you. <laughs> I just pick one person to agree with because it's too confusing. <laughs> when I get too many conflicting answers, I just have to roll with it. Um, okay, I'm just going to take a bit of a guess here, I guess. Uh, it looks like we're coming in here. Kind of. I'm willing to guess like here. I think we'll be close enough with that. All right, not bad. Just at the wrong side of the hospital, unfortunately. I thought maybe that would be it because it had two lanes, but actually I see that this had two lanes now also, so. Close enough. I'll take it. I'll take it. Oh, sweet Jesus. Oh, God. We're, we're in, like, Denmark or Sweden or something again. What's this? <laughs> what is it? We're really going for the Nordic countries this time, aren't we? Does that say translation? I need translation. What's this? Iceland? Oh, yeah. You Yes. Oh, my God. Yeah. I completely forgot it could be Iceland. Oh, this place looks cool. All right. Wait, there's a bus. Follow that bus. Wait, the Faroe Islands? The what? Yeah. Wait, where are the Faroe Islands? Cork? <laughs> yes, it's in Cork. <laughs> I found it. The island nation of Cork. Okay, that's a surprise. It's Finland? Okay. How do I... How do I find them? You might have to direct me here. Uh, unless it comes up as I zoom in. Because I've... I've not heard of these. Wait. Here, maybe? There? Everything is in Cork. All right, you know what? I'll leave it here for a second while I take a look around and then you can give me directions. It's not Finland? Scotland? <laughs> what? <laughs> huh? <laughs> How have I not heard of this? Oh, yes. Okay, wait. No, I remember now. Yay. Okay, yeah, I get it. I get it. I know now. I blanked that completely. I was very confused. I think my mind was too much in the, like... Nordic country mode. Yeah. All right. Now we just got to find out which island. This can't be that hard, right? They're going to have something. That's... I. T the problem is when it's not English, it makes it kind of hard to figure out what's just like the name of a store or what's like the name of the place. This place looks cool. I imagine it would be a place you go to and there's absolutely nothing to do. But, you know, um, it looks nice. Uh, we might struggle here to get an exact... I imagine this is actually one of the bigger places. So I might just look around for... Um, for some kind of town. Are they all connected? Oh, they are connected. So then you can drive between them there. That is cool. Um, right, will we just guess in the middle somewhere? Or even the, the Joe Pizza... <laughs> I know I find that so funny. <laughs> it's just the middle of nowhere. It's like they didn't even try with the name. Um, let let me put it here. This place. Oh, that might be too built up. You know what? Feck it. I'm going there. Oh, okay. I was a little far off. But 29 kilometers away, that's still a lot of points. I'll take it. Oh, where are we now? This is very different. Hmm. South America? Hmm. Point out if I'm missing anything here. Because sometimes I see stuff on a sign and I, I glance at it and I don't spot it. Uh, Germany, it has to be. <laughs> I like your attitude. Um, Cork. <laughs> we just default everything to either Cork or Germany. And that's it. There's got to be a sign around here somewhere. This feels like... Oh, oh, Brazil. Okay. Well, I guess that doesn't confirm it. Like, we have United Kingdom banks in Ireland, but I'd assume it is Brazil. Um, we need to... Oh? Is that just air conditioning? Is that what that says? I, I don't know. I was hoping it might have the name of the place or something. Oh, wait, bus. Rio Branco. Okay. That's... Brazil is feckin' massive, though. 
Anyone want to help me out here? <laughs> Hello, Anna. Brazil is huge. It really is. Hmm. Real? D Left of Brazil. Okay. Yo, Branco. Is that, should I be looking for that? Or is that like just a street name or what? The... <sighs> Oh, oh wait, hold on. <laughs> By some miracle, I have managed to find it. <laughs> okay, great. Oh god, the place is huge. Um Right, I'll just assume we're here and I'll go back to the stat. How the hell did that happen? Um I could look for the bank, maybe. This oh my god, like these buildings look massive. This, uh, we must be in some like financial district, are we? Um, God, it looks so nice here. Hmm. I don't know whether I should look... Like, the bank is just over here, isn't it? It's down the street. Yeah, the ba maybe I should just look for the bank. It looks super central, so I imagine... Oops, sorry, my alarm's going off. So I imagine it's like here somewhere, right? It's in the south. Look for the hotel. I could do, to be fair. Wait. South section, maybe. Oh, this is going to be hard, isn't it? Maybe I should look for something a little bigger. Because I am, I, I might be looking for a needle in a haystack here. Uh, yeah. I might need something that stands out a bit more. What do you think? Try and find the river? That's not a bad idea, actually. Let me let me go down this way. And I'll just go straight. Hmm. Okay, there's a big park. Hmm, I don't know what that means. <laughs> it's like I'm zooming in for clues and I'm like, I don't speak Portuguese. <laughs> uh okay, we got a road coming into town? Big road? So we do, we might be on the edge of town somewhere? Oh, we might just have to take a guess here. It could be around here. Hmm. I think I'm willing to take a guess. What do you think? Just got here. Is this Germany? <laughs> e under the river? Uh, let's see. Like under here? E? Right above the letter E. Wait. Oh, is that just because I selected? <laughs> um, you see, the more you zoom in, the more there is. I don't know where the bank would even show up. Like, would I have to be very zoomed in for it to show up? Um, are we in Germany? I think so. All right, I... Look for the park. The problem is there's a few. Like, there's a park here. That's pretty big. There's a, a bank there, but I assume that's not the bank we're looking for. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Did it say the name of the park? God. Why can I not go back? Go, Bring me over. Oh, no. That wasn't. I thought that was a sign for the park. God damn it. Um... I think I'm willing to bet just around here somewhere. Let's take a guess. Holy shit, we were far away. <laughs> what the hell? No wonder we were in the complete wrong city. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Well, that bus lied to us. <laughs> it can't be going that far, is it? <laughs> okay. We relied far too much on that bus. Oh, for feck's sake. <laughs> God damn it. I trusted that bus and it lied to me. Merrick, thank you very much for the bits. I, I appreciate that. And thank you so much for the follows, gang. I really appreciate all the follows. Um, oh, sorry. Hold on. I got to make um, a quick little tweet about, um, about me video. One second. Here we go.
Bear with me. Okay, perfect. And then... Sorry now, I just gotta make a quick little... Uh... Ah, my head. A quick little tweet and sort this out. And we'll be good to go. Um... Do 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 do. Sorry now. Gonna make a quick comment as well. My apologies. I don't mean to keep you waiting. It's unfortunate that my upload time kind of conflicts with my stream time. Um, it is very very unfortunate, but here we go. Second. Okay. And. Let me put this up here. And there you go. Okay, sorted. I'm still just so betrayed by that feckin' boss. So, I'm so betrayed. This is honestly the greatest twist I've ever seen. Greatest anime betrayals. Like, what do we even believe anymore after that? Alright. Are we some we're somewhere in Asia, right? I'll need help. <laughs> Germany? No, I don't think so. Uh, Philip, thank you for the bits. That's very kind. And Ella, thank you for the, the sub as well. Very kind. Uh, Israel? Okay. What can I look for here? Um, intersection, maybe? Okay. I'm not going to lie, this is going to be an extremely tough one. Uh, I need something to... Oh wait, there's a street sign over there. Does this help? Try to look for a big sign. You're right, I'll look for a massive sign. If I find a big sign, someone in chat will have an idea, right? What the hell is that thing? Jesus Christ, that's terrifying. What's that? There's got to be something big here. Hmm. Yeah, I need... I need to just <laughs> have one of those maps that says you are here. It's just hard when the language doesn't resemble English at all because I don't even know if the sign is relevant. We're not trusting bosses again, that's for sure. Okay, what about this? Does this help at all? The old city, it says? I mean, that probably doesn't help at all now that I think about it. I got a lot of people saying it's Israel, but we do get... We're getting some others as well. Jerusalem, you think? I've seen Thailand as well. But I think most people are saying Israel, so I guess we'll go with Israel. Well, Israel's quite small, isn't it? Bear with me. My, I'm uh, when you start getting into like this area of the world, my geography is quite bad, and also my brain is half asleep. You think Jerusalem? Hmm. This is going to be hard. Um, okay, wait, wait, the writing is Hebrew, so it's Israel. Since it's the old city, I assume that means Jerusalem. Okay. Do you think we should just guess on there? Because I feel like this is going to be a really difficult one. Does this help? <laughs> I'm just wandering around. It's the blind leading the blind at this point now. And no, thank you for that. Look for a college, maybe? Um, but the place looks huge as well. Oh? Maybe? I'm willing to just guess. There, I think. There's a, a university there. Will we guess that? 
the outer city and that is kind of the outer city hmm <laughs> thank you liam all right it said tech college go south from the college hmm I think I'm willing to just take a guess because I don't I, I don't think I have the capability of getting too close here. Yeah, I'm going to guess. All right, you know what? 73. I'll take it. We were in the complete wrong section, but I guess that makes sense because there was there were signs to the old city. But uh, that's not bad. At least the boss didn't lie to us again. I wouldn't be able to take that. Not too bad, not too bad. Oh, this place looks lovely. Oh no, I'm gonna need a lot of help again, everyone. <laughs> as soon as it's like, like, cause if it's a European language or like, you know, Spanish or Portuguese or whatever, sometimes the words look similar. But if the if the language has no relation at all to English, then I, I am lost. This place looks freaking cool though. Jesus. All right, where are we, Japan? I'm thinking Germany. <laughs> Wait, am I stuck? I can't seem to get out of this loop. Maybe I can take a left up here instead? Okay, good, I can. It's a dead end. Hmm. <sighs> Jesus, strange road. We're going through different seasons on parts of the same road somehow. Okay. I need assistance. <laughs> trying to look for a big sign. Apologies if I miss something that's actually useful. Because I'm just trying to make it certain that the sign is going to be useful by looking for a big one, you know? Uh, is that helpful? That's probably a street name, I guess. Uh, we're gonna need a bigger sign. There's bound to be one down here at like an intersection, right? Oh, big sign. Okay, is this helpful at all? <laughs> is that helpful? Got a blue sign there, white sign up here. Definitely Japan. Yeah, I think we can 100% say Japan. It's... Do I trust you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're just waiting to betray me. Ah, oh, for feck's sake. I don't... God damn it. Where is it? I think the bus sign is in Braille anyway, so I don't think it matters. It's just... Can it chew at the side? Don't do it. I don't think I should trust it either. God, I lost where I was for a second there. Um, what do you think? The boss lies. Maybe we should just leave the boss. These are so difficult. Why can't everywhere just speak garlic? Um, more signs. Oh god, it got very dreary now all of a sudden. Oh, 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 here we go. Yoda, he'll help us. <laughs> all right, that's got to be a... I was going to say, that's got to be a sign. That's got to be, like, a helpful sign, right? Shonen Life Town. Southern Japan, you think? Um. Oh, sorry. Any idea? It's north? I get so much conflicting information. God help me if I actually ever need directions from you guys. <laughs> He'll send me all over the planet and I'll end up in Germany no matter where I want to go. Um, right. On the coast? Which coast? Find it, you will. Thank you, Yoda. Left the middle. Oh, Jesus. Uh, wait, did, did we see something like this earlier? Kashiro? Or is that my 
a little bit east. Um, now you're just trying to mess with me. I don't know what's real and what's not. Oh, I'm in danger. I'm lost. Thank you so much for the follows, everyone. You're kind. Black Eyed Fish, thank you for the, the bits. Stefan, uh, it's Milk Taylor. Oh. Joy, G, Andre, Dust Donal, Ella, uh, Philip Nope, and uh, Mark said thank you very much as well. You're very kind. Middle of the main island on west coast. Look for the numbers. Are these road numbers? I'd assume. I don't know if I'm close enough to look for numbers yet because I don't even know where I should be looking. I'm, try I'm trying to let the chat help me, but it's kind of hard. <laughs> Um, is it Nigata people are saying? I, I saw two different people say that, so let me take a look. Um, Yoda. Is it up here? Yoda, please, where are you? I guess I could look for the numbers from here. 47 and 404. <laughs> My brain is 404 right now. 404? Okay. We got the Ouya over here. 404. Um, wait. Are we here? 404. I guess we gotta see where it intersects with 47. Is that what we should look for? The 404 keeps going. Jesus. Oh, sweet but Jesus. It's such a long road. Is that still the 404? No, it's not. Okay. 404. We're looking for 47. Are we? Am, am I doing great? 47 was on the right. Still 404, 404. No, it's 403 now. Shit, <laughs> this is hard. <laughs> Why is it not easy? Would 47 be a smaller road? At least we're getting closer. Thank you for the tips. Is there anything else we can look for? This isn't really working. I'm just wondering, do I have to zoom in closer, you know? 23 is there. 10. Okay, yeah, I do think I have to be more zoomed in. Okay, that turned... Okay, okay. I can do this. I can be this zoomed in and move along. Um... Um... 47... I probably skidded over it now. I just... <sighs> Maybe this isn't a good strategy. What do you think? That's too far from Tokyo? Wait, but we're looking for 404 road. Why should we be near Tokyo? <laughs> like, I'm not trying to be smart. I'm actually asking. Why? Why? <laughs> why should we be close to Tokyo? <sighs> this is feckin' hard. South of Tokyo. Check around Tokyo. Really? Wait, I'm going to leave this here. Wait, really? I'm a bit concerned here where you're bringing me. It felt like we were on the right track. Were we not? Hmm. Is there more 404 roads? Like, I, I don't know. It seems confusing. <laughs> I love that roads are just all over the place. Like, you got 51 going on to 354 and all this. It's so confusing in every country. There's obviously some system to it that I'm too small brain to understand. <laughs> but I just don't get it. 404. It, uh, yeah, my brain is 404. -ing. It spans across the country? I don't know if it does. I, I saw the start and end. You know what? I'm taking an executive decision here and just guessing. You were right. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> After all that, I was just getting frustrated with not being able to find it. There's Pesky Road 47. Honestly, I think that would have taken me so long to find. I think I'm better off. <laughs> Alright, how do I do... <laughs> how do I do a custom map? One second. I want to see this one. <laughs> I can't believe that. Okay. Uh... Wait, I can just go onto this. <laughs> yeah, I am the former esports captain, yes. <laughs> Alright, Ireland, but it's... What? <laughs> 
This is the custom map. Wait, it's feckin' moving! <laughs> Do they have a Google boat now? <sighs> what? GG, <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? I am so confused. How is this a thing? I'm on a boat, yes. <laughs> How am I supposed to find this? It's somewhere in Ireland. But, like, I can't choose where I want to sail. I just have to keep sailing the Suez Canal. <laughs> oh my god, I'm the one that's gonna block it. I'm so confused. Where's I think I'm heading further and further out to sea. <laughs> okay, wait. So, north is that way. Judging by this compass. So, I sh I'm heading east. Right? But I'm on the coast somewhere? Where the hell am I? I'm gonna be in some bay, right? Do you I'm gonna guess I'm here. Oh my god, I was so wrong. Why are we in a lake? <laughs> How was I supposed to solve this? GG on that one. Jesus. And CCC, thank you so much. You know what we should do? We should do Mario Maker. If people want to make... um. Uh, if people want to make Mario Maker levels and put on how can you tag them? Can you put on hashtag CMK because I would be totally down to do your horrible Mario Maker levels This is a great map. How did you find this? I am so impressed. How did you do that? I'm so confused. That's oh, that's true. I was in Northern Ireland I didn't even think about that to be fair. I still probably would have just guessed here then at that rate or like and no, that's too busy. I probably would have just gone for like one of the bays here. Like there in Wexford, I suppose. Seven points though. Better than nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Won't Mario Maker be even more confounding? Yeah, I guess. Uh, but we're gonna try it. What how can you do it in Mario Maker? Are you able to put hashtags on them? Because I would love Super Mario Maker 2. Yes, yes, sorry. I should be more specific. I, I know nothing about it. I just think it would be really fun. Seven whole points. It's a win. I think it's a win. <laughs> There's no bosses in the water. They just say it's Brazil again anyway and just lie to me. <laughs> How many points for Cork? <laughs> How are city names in garlic so weird? They, they are very weird. I think you can share codes and tag. Okay, if you want to put in... Hashtag CMK for call me Kevin. Then I'll take a look either on stream or video. I think it'd be really fun. Um, Corpse Kitty, Otters are great, Azure, Black Eye Fish, Stefan, uh, Milk Burley, thank you very much. Taylor, Joy, thank you for all the support. I appreciate it. Um, right, gang, I think I was going to say it's been a short stream, but it's not. It's been three hours, 20 minutes. But. It feels like it's been short for some reason. Uh, I am having a lot of fun. I'm just... I feel a bit feckin' under the weather with this... Uh, these antibiotics I'm on are just taking their toll. You should go lay down and drink water. I think I should too. Uh, I still have to record some stuff as well. But my brain's just like... Not working. Not working at all. It's just a mess. Um, but yeah, I need to... Uh, I need to go relax, I think, for a little bit. Um, then do my, do my little recording. Um, but, uh, thank you so much, folks, for the, um, the support. I appreciate it. All the subs, bits, and all that, I super appreciate. And thank Kevin is high. I honestly felt it earlier. My brain, I just felt like I was just so out of it. Thank you for the follows, everyone. I really appreciate it. Thank you for joining our little call... Community. Community. <laughs> yep, that's fine. Um, but I did post a video just there if you want to check it out. Some Fall Guys. I think it's pretty fun. I actually wouldn't mind playing some like Fall Guys now on stream and stuff. But I think it's for the best that I go get some rest. Um, I don't stream on Wednesdays, so I won't be streaming tomorrow. But I will be streaming on Thursday. I think we're going to try some more Minecraft. So we'll see how that goes. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for joining me. I do do really, really, really appreciate it. Um, I'm going to send a raid over to Kiwo. 
Um, the last time he won Dan, we're playing some Monster Hunter. I sent people over to Dan. This time I'll send them to Kiwo. So go enjoy that. Uh, thank you so much for joining me. I appreciate you just following along with my stuff and um, just being a chilled out community. Spending your time here means a lot to me. Thank you for the 666 followers. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, enjoy your day, night, morning, whatever it might be, and enjoy the stream that I'm heading off, uh, that I'm heading you off to Brain No Worky, Brain 404. My brain's south of Tokyo right now. Um, but yeah, enjoy your time, folks, and I'll see you again soon. Videos on the channel, remember, some Fall Guys. I think it's a fun one. I think it turned out pretty good, so, you know, season four and all that. But yeah. <laughs> anyway, enjoy. Bye, 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 b